Lexi, what's up? Grover will be joining us possibly in a couple of hours. And then uh, he found a location for us to go to. Beanie Weenie, what's up? How you doing? Thank you too for all the love. I just had a hell of a day. One of the hoses, the supply lines for my sink blew underneath my sink and flooded my whole fucking kitchen. I live in an old house so my shut off valves didn't work. So I went down to the meter and turned that valve all the way closed and it didn't work. So it's just sitting there flooding my whole fucking kitchen. Good times. You know you live in an old house when the fucking main line won't shut off. Misty. It's like a ladies night in here, in here. damn. Let's see. I think we have one more rank to go up and I'm done doing rank. Yeah, it sucked. It was a big mess. It was so funny too, because one of my cats, he's not real intelligent and he's just sitting there and water's flowing around him and his paws are wet and he's just kind of like picking them up slowly like, what the fuck? <laughs> he's not running or anything, he's just standing there. <laughs> my floor's clean though. <laughs> what a night. <laughs> ah, it's alright, Lexi. Shit happens. Alright, so see. The best thing is I want the Ace hardware and I knew what I needed. I took a picture of it. I knew exactly what I needed. And the guy's like, well, I don't think that's what you need. I was like, J just, dude, I didn't ask you to help me. Just go away. <laughs> so I was like, I know exactly what it is I need. All right, we got a couple missions. Thank you, Lexi. Too helpful. <laughs> yeah. Well, no, he was wanting me to buy the supply lines for a washer. And it's different than the one I had. Yeah, you know, the one I had was a lot different. So I was like, no, that's not what I need. And that's why I took a picture of it, because it's a different type of line. <laughs> so, <laughs> I should have looked at ships. I didn't look at ships. Oh no, where's my boys? Thank you, Lexi.
I saw that. Thank you so much. Sorry, I'm going. Copy and pasting. I don't know how to do the the hotkeys. I'm not that smart. <laughs> I get confused very easy when it comes to that shit. That's awesome, Lexi. That's that is like the best news ever, right there. I guarantee that's a lot of stress off of you. Oh, I bet you are. Facebook finally loaded for you. Set of enemies after you. Yep, enemy alert. Yay, assholes. What well, Facebook's been really weird lately. Yeah, I don't do a lot with Facebook except for this stream. I, I hardly ever get on it. I need to get on my YouTube page and figure it out because I've hell all I've been doing is streaming to it. I don't even know what it looks like. I know yesterday, whenever I first streamed, my Facebook chat wouldn't load up. Come on, you bastard. See, if it takes me too long, it'll pull me out. Ha, got him. Thank you, Misty. Oh, shit, too fast. Trying to wean yourself off Facebook. Yeah, I'm not... Like the only thing I use Facebook for is to stream.
I need to figure out how to get my chat to pop up on my window. That way when people are chatting and on YouTube, they can see what Facebook is saying. Or, yeah. Yeah, both ways. Try this and see what it does. don't know if that works yeah I, I think it's chat box I just added it so it should be working now but I don't know I didn't want to make it too small because I want it to be legible. <laughs> so. Yeah, that was my, that's my transition. Uh, yeah, this is my transition. It's part of the overlays that I got. But see, the chat popped up on the screen but it goes away, it doesn't stay on there. Hmm. We'll figure it out. Yeah, I do, I have, I have uh, gold. I have gold and they've never sent me my fucking t-shirt and it pisses me off. And then they try saying I've redeemed it already. Um, honestly, I, I've been meaning to talk to Wreck-It Renee and see what she's using because whatever the program she's using comes with a noise canceling program already and the audio is a hundred times better and uh that's something streamlabs doesn't have or at least i haven't found in it so far <laughs> yeah I, well it, and it just says i've redeemed it already and i obviously haven't motherfuckers Probably mailed it to my neighbor.
Gardner. Right. <laughs> he was probably wearing my t-shirt when he dropped my mail off. part he doesn't even know is for uh, actual streaming, he probably thinks it's like a fishing shirt. I got this shirt with my fly fishing rod. Yeah. Oh shit, I want this on. Oh shit. Alright. Holding dock. Oh, that sucks. That sucks. It's a good game, though. It really is. And I wish Xbox had some type of VR with it. And I, I just don't know why they're not doing that. Because everyone around them is doing it. And they're not, they're just not fucking doing it. I know Grove would be ecstatic if everyone started getting Elite Dangerous because he loves this game. <laughs> I know it's a it's it's going to be a huge market. It's already a pretty big market, and I just I don't understand why they at least wouldn't get their foot in the door with it because once somebody it does take off with somebody like majorly, they're going to be behind. See, one of my favorite movies. It's not like my favorite movie, but it's, it's way up there. It would be that Ready Player One with it's like the whole VR world. If someone ever comes out with that, Xbox is fucked. <laughs> so, I mean, a complete open world VR game. Shit.
for space base. Oh, that'd be awesome. Motherfucker. Come on, motherfucker. I know it got horrible reviews with people, but I thought it was fucking pretty awesome to be, to be honest. <laughs> oh, yes. I mean, it could be really appreciated mostly by gamers, but at the same time, the story was pretty cool. I mean, <laughs> Cola here. Scan detected. Oh, damn, I didn't want that. Fuck, I bought one that wasn't for the Federation. Damn it. Back. Yes, awesome. You know, I've... And I said I've never played VR, but I did, but it wasn't the same quality. I bought my son one of the uh, Star Wars VR headsets that you just put your phone in. And, uh... It, it was pretty much sw just swinging a lightsaber, but there wasn't a lot of detail, but it was fun. So, to play a game with detail and doing that, I think that would be a blast.
I think that's I need to go to one of those places for one of my ships. Invader is a legit scary in person. <laughs> Now, some of these are going to be a long ways away, I believe. I think we have enough for now. We'll pick some up somewhere else. So we're at 21%. Oh, we got this. So we have eight. Yeah, we're good there. And these are all local. See, I fuck up. Sometimes like, I pick up a mission and it'll say six days. Well, I can't reach those. Because <laughs> it'll be like all the way across the galaxy. And then you have to cancel them, which hurts you on rip. I actually paid for it. Um, there's a guy here locally. I I think he's still in business. Crimson used him. Silent Rage used him. Grover is going to, but I think he's going to go local his way. So, but um, and I can actually get you his contact. He, uh, but you have copyright rights to it. You actually get the rights to your logo but it wasn't too expensive I think I paid like 75 bucks I think Crimson ended up paying like 60 <laughs> so, and so and all you have to do is you just tell him what you want and you know, he'll write up a couple sketches and send them to you and then send you the finished product and you can tweak it however you want it, I mean, he's real good to deal with. Oh, if you have software to make it, though. Just don't worry about being picky with yourself. I mean, if you don't, if you don't like it, work on it. I mean, don't rush it. Take your time with it if you're making it yourself. Enemy alert, enemy alert. I got a bunch of fucking enemies coming after me. Awesome. Come on, bitches. Oh, there it is. Yeah, it's, it's popping up. Now, I hope YouTube pops up too. But I wish it would stay a little bit. I might have to look online because that's just what the app has. And if I get on Streamlabs online, then there might be more available to me. A 
pay for when my stuff looks bad. Like, I doubt it'll look bad, though. I mean, honestly, just think of an idea of what you want and then stick with that idea. And then don't be afraid to critique yourself and then ask other people. Shit, ask your kids. They probably have better uh, imaginations than we do. <laughs> but like Eric he did like I, honestly the one I have is one of the first sketches he gave me and I just fly to him and said hey I want a cartoony beaver with a walking stick and a Hawaiian shirt and that's what he came up with and I was like son of a bitch he nailed it That's how my son came up with, uh, his, when he was real young, he drew this one picture, and it's actually one of my icons. Actually, it's my icon on the Xbox. And I love that thing. Sick pup, what's up, man? Grover will be joining us here in about an hour and a half. If you're still going to be on, if you're playing, you're welcome to join, man. He said he found a location, though. I don't know if we'll be in that system, but we can Request come to towards your way. To Thanks for the share. Music so peaceful going on in here. Scan detected. I just auto launched. Ah, oh, fuck! I gotta go back in here again. Fuck me. I'm going to end it out so we can listen to more of it. <laughs> Son of a bitch. in there again.
Warbird, what's up, man? Important music rules. <laughs> Have you tried uh, docking solo yet, sick pup? That's, I can't, I'm horrible at it. I fucking hate docking. And most of my ships are really fucking big, so it's like I barely fit anywhere. That's <laughs> too big for the pad. I have one that's too girthy and I got one that's too long. <laughs> <laughs> now we can auto launch. Have a small cargo ship. I can fit anywhere. <laughs> Damn it, Lexi has my mind in the gutter now. <laughs> <laughs> right? <laughs> Frame shift drive charging. Yeah, he's he's got a plan. He's going to uh, start doing YouTube and uh, keep putting streams out there. And you know, me and Crimson are going to be throwing out his uh, YouTube page on our streams and doing Patreon. I mean, as far as Facebook goes, though, they're. He's tried. But for sure, anyone who hasn't f uh, followed him on YouTube, please go over and subscribe. While you there, check out mine. <laughs> Let me know how it looks because I haven't been on it. I'm, I'm streaming to it. I stream to YouTube right now, but I I haven't looked at my page yet. It's probably horrible of me. But. <laughs> oh, no. My cat... Oh shit! She, oh, yeah, she's 
She farted like a damn man. I swear you can hear cheeks slapping. <laughs> Thank you. Science and Bonnie Cyrus videos. <laughs> Fuck. <laughs> yeah, and my cat also, she, uh, She's like most cats are graceful and yeah, you know, all this. And she's not graceful at all. I, I mean, she'll jump off a shelf and it sounds like she broke a leg. She lands so hard. It's like, holy shit. Yesterday, she was walking right in front of the sink and she fell over. <laughs> My cat's got issues. I need to get her a little helmet. Yeah, like these stations here, I never attempted to land on them, but <sighs> yeah, it looks difficult. I know I just filled that fucker up. Damn, it tastes like it's empty. Fuck the query. Hmm. 
not comply. I got a side window when he's talking about getting motion sickness. Damn. That'd be pretty cool too. That's why I was. I think it'd be cool if they had like Easter eggs in here, where there'd be like Star Trek and Star Wars references. Oh boy, I can't get to that one. They might pull me out. Away. He's going to get me again. Escape bars. Escape 25 interdictions. And you can walk around and just, see that's that would be pretty awesome. Wayne, what's up, man? We're at it again. What's that, Warbird? Honestly, I mean, I don't have a problem with YouTube and Patreon. And I haven't had an issue with Facebook, but I don't post anything except for streams. So, looks a bit cold there. Yeah, my studio doesn't have heat. <laughs> so, and then, it, temperature dropped drastically here. So... And I'm still cold because my water supply line to my sink blew today. Flooded my fucking kitchen. And of course it was the cold water. So, <laughs> so I was soaking wet and I still haven't fucking warmed up from it. Now see, I... Probably you're going to get some hate for this, but I've never been a fan of Iron Man. Space hate. <laughs> yeah, that water line kicked my fucking ass today. So I went down, I went in my basement and turned the main shutoff valve off. Well, it's a really old fucking house. And, uh... It didn't turn the water off. <laughs> so I said, fuck it. I went to the water main along the street. And I turned it off there. <laughs> that motherfucker didn't turn it off. So I don't have to worry about getting my water shut off. Because even when they think they're shutting my water off, I still have it. 
<laughs> so I had to just let it flood in my kitchen and go to a hardware store and take about an hour and get rid of a ton of fucking water. That sucks. Only reputation. <laughs> it wasn't that bad. It, uh, I disconnected one of my ducks that was near it, my furnace ducks, and just kind of let it drain into the basement. So. It may has made a mess, but it could have been a hell of a lot worse. percent we got five more. okay yeah we'll do those if I had one of the buckets from Sea of Thieves I wouldn't have an issue one scoop and it'd be empty <laughs> the magic buckets. Thanks, man. But it's no big deal. Shit happens. It's part of owning a house or a car or anything. <laughs> Gotta fix shit when it breaks. Finally found you.
two thousand light seconds. He's definitely going to try to get me. Probably a couple of times. I'll have to look that up, Warbird. Been slacking on my anime. I've been watching Star Trek lately. Nineteen hundred hours of anime watching now. <laughs> Star Trek Online for Xbox. What kind of game is it? Is it kind of like this where you're flying around or is it more of a strategy game? I'll have to look that up. Or fuck, I'll ask Grover. <laughs> right before I can fucking shift. Nope. Hell yeah. We see a good station today. the wrong people and now you have to pay the price they're gonna be chasing me all fucking day now son of a bitch Yeah, <laughs> I always have a target on my back. <laughs> Bad thing is, this ship here, I can't really fight back in it.
guess this is the same as buying love. Check out the shipyard, see if it's any good. Cracked down three, never played it. I don't know if I've ever heard of it. Right there, sick pup. That's the one you want to get for hauling off cargo. I think uh, mine hauls 756 cargo. And so you can knock out missions real fast and make a lot of money. It's slow and it's a big target, but thirty four per cent. <laughs> Sometimes a bigger load's better, buddy. <laughs> <laughs> yes, you did. Slow the fuck down. <laughs> exactly. I know she's not in here. She didn't respond to that one. <laughs>
couldn't help myself. We don't judge here. That one pays a lot, and I'd oh, that one might be a long ways away. Fuck it. Check out these ships while we're here. Anaconda, that one right there, sick pup. That's that's the fucking ship right there. I haul like 320 cargo in that one, and it's completely stocked up as a gunship. So if anyone interdicts you, you got it. <laughs> That's the one I want. Warbird, thanks for stopping in, man. See, this ship here is one a lot of people like to. I have not gotten that one yet. This one looks cool, but and it's fast, but it's not a good gunship. I just sold mine of this one. This station has a bunch of ships. I'll have to remember that. Thirty-seven. See you, Warbird.
<laughs> Shit, with the Anaconda, you don't even have to really dogfight. I mean, do you have enough guns on there and defense turrets? It does everything for you. Get me on this one. Joel, thanks for the like. Welcome. Awesome if I could get ranked up before Grover hops on. It's not gonna happen. There's not enough donations where I can bump it up quick. too quiet he's gonna grab me soon he's got to it's not much of a pirate if he doesn't Yesterday once completely surprised me. It made me jump out of my fucking skin. Don't tempt me. <laughs> He flagged me as soon as I got out of hyperspeed, so was, I knew it was coming. Grover got hit four times in one trip yesterday. But he, I think he was hauling gold. And when you haul a lot of gold, you put a target on your back. <laughs> you can't even see that place.
They don't even have commodities here, damn. See that need donations. You got a hooked on anime. <laughs> Ain't nothing wrong with that. Man, we've been zigzagging all over the damn place. Thirty-eight. We only went up one percent. Son of a bitch. <laughs> I have the ship on my scanner. Aren't you something? He almost had me. I was getting bars removed from it that time. Oh, see, I like anime. The Sword Art Online, playing Sword Online, Art Online really got me hooked. And then I started watching the show. And then whenever I finished those up, I started watching other shows. <laughs> Comic Kill is 
Yeah, that's a really good one. Yeah, there's uh, there's one. Um, fuck, I can't remember. What it's. Like no skill, no life, or something like that. But it's about going into a virtual world, and there's nudity and everything in that damn movie or TV show. <laughs> it's like holy shit. <laughs> My son's probably already watching a bunch of anime movies. Nice, that'd be awesome. Two percent.
25 minutes. That was a nice smooth run. I hope this was a fancy one. We haven't been on a fancy one all day. Detected. Landing gear deployed. Are you gonna pay me for that one? You assholes. No, it's not. That's disappointing. We will pick up a few more. And Grover hops on. He said he found a place that we need to go, so I'm not exactly sure where we're going. <laughs> so. All good donations.
Donations are a quick level. They give you a good rep for that. One percent, hell yeah. See, we'll stick with these five because in about 25 minutes he'll be hopping on and we should have these done. So, we know what happened last time we traveled with missions in our pockets. We got shot down constantly. Hey, look, there's Earth. Boom. <laughs> Delivery bonus. 41 minutes. They're giving me tons of time to deliver this shit. So usually when that guy pops up in a corner telling me, you know, that it's a n number one cruise liner and your flight attendant will take care of you, usually I don't get attacked when he's popping up. So hopefully, it still doesn't make me out to be a liar. <laughs> And I mean, that made me out to be a liar. You motherfuckers. And I'm on her way.
That could be one of the other missions, though. <laughs> Stop talking about it. <laughs> Pretty planet there. See, I wish those ones there we can land on, but they're so big that they can't map out the whole thing. You can only land on the small ones. way for that chat box to stay up. I need to hook up one more monitor to my system too. Because if we're going to start using Discord, I can actually have like all three or yeah, all three of our cameras up. Successful. And that'll be fun with uh, like Friday the Thirteenth, so you can actually see everybody jump. That's <laughs> I did find out why I was hostile yesterday because I'm hostile right now. It's because I don't have any reputation with this faction. This is the Alliance faction. Oh no, it's the Independent faction. Yeah, hell like, I've never dealt with them at all. See, if I'm just playing on Xbox and not streaming, it never lags right there. But only whenever I'm using my companion app does it lag. Yeah, yeah, I can do missions for them, and it doesn't take long to get reputation that, on that bar. 
It takes a long time to get rank, but reputation is real easy to get. Late years. Oh my God. I mean, I'm not going to fucking. Yeah, we're not going to do this one. Let me look at this one. It's not letting me jump. Available. It's always a couple I have to abandon, and it sucks because it hurts your reputation, but you get it back fairly quick. Frame shift drive charging. Reputation went down to 98 percent. Whoopty fucking do. <laughs> so. Like the way that was going, since it was under one light year away, it was pretty much like 900,000 light seconds away. And it said it would take me a day and a half to get there. That's real time. So if I would have stayed right there, it would have taken me a day and a half to travel there. Which is probably a spot no one ever fucking goes to, so it'd be kind of cool to actually commit and try to do it but <laughs> come on that's fucked up
so we might pick up two more just to finish our five. Oh, maybe three more. Motherfucker. Here's another one that's out of reach. Still 98%. Just cancel another one. <laughs> Now, you, once you get your rank, you, you don't lose your rank, but you just, your reputation fucks with you. Lighting gear deployed. It's the jump distance. Like, my ship can only handle a certain distance. I think it's uh, 22 light years. So, if the jump's too far, it'll be red and it won't let me jump. I can take the mission and it won't say anything. Did I cancel the mission I was just fucking... I think I canceled the wrong one. I'm an idiot. Yeah. I think I did. No, I didn't. What the fuck happened? But I'm here, so I'll see. <laughs> I did something wrong. So I need three of them. Nah, eh, nothing fun. Oh, this was a wasted trip. The detail in that just blows my mind. Okay. I'll see you in a little while. Or tomorrow. Depending on kids. <laughs> you woke up at 3 a.m. Oh, man. That sucks. So I woke up at six. I thought that was bad.
Wang City. Yeah, I love the details in this game. That's what blows my mind with the amount of information they have in this game is just Talking completed. Power down system.
nothing good. Come on, have a good shipyard at least. Oh, only nine. Got all the federal ships at least. Cool station to go to. Damn. All oh, these are identical. Docking couplers disengaged. Observe station regulations on exit. This one has a couple trees in it. Nothing like the others. Damn, there's a plant right next to this sun. Wow, that's cool. It'd be cool if we could land on that one. We're even facing the right direction. Damn, that's good.
Yeah, that's a big plant. Of course, now we're going to get past it. Shit. We're going so slow and then... Six percent. We're going slow today.
Okay, Grover. If you want, um, we'll go and, uh, into your lobby on Discord because I haven't figured this shit out yet. You, you're going to have to talk me through this. <laughs> so it'll probably be easier. trying to figure it out. Got it. Okay. Never mind. Never mind. I'm in my lobby now, but I don't know if I'm going to be able to hear you. more we got. That's not bad. Oh shit. Hello, can you hear me? Yes, I can hear you. Give me a few minutes. We're we're working on some last we got this stuff we got to go okay look i'm working on props for a youtube video <laughs> and it's a matter of timing so i'll be right back all right oh that's a cool looking planet
Starting slow. Delivery bonus. One hour. Shit, I went right past it. I was trying to find a new chat box. I don't like how they disappear constantly.
This one might be a cool looking one inside. Hello. Got it done. Got it done. I'm up to sixty one percent on my rank. No shit. Yeah. We're working on uh, our Star Trek uniforms for the video. Nice. And it cost us about $45. And that, that stuff that I've gathered up in the last couple of months, I had to order stuff from Amazon and they sent us the wrong shit. So. We didn't have to send them the shit back, but we had to wait for them to send us the right shit. Right. But our Starfleet uniforms cost about about $45. Oh shit, that's not bad. I would say that that was, uh, we were able to make them because of patrons. For sure. 100% because of the patrons. Well, you timed it perfect because I'm headed to my last one that I want to do today for my courier missions. Yeah. And then we could do whatever. I would have been done a little bit ago, but I accidentally picked up ones I couldn't reach. One of them, the fucking station, was a day and a half from the star. It was point two light years. I was like, what? <laughs> like, I couldn't go any faster to it. I'm like, and I couldn't jump to it. <laughs> so, I was like, well, I'm not doing that one. <laughs> so, So good, it was so cheap, so close, you know, the system was, but it was so far away, it was a hundred thousand freaking light seconds away from the damn. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. 
Well, that's like these missions only last 24 hours. And it'd take me longer than that to get to the damn station. <laughs> There's got to be something with that. It wouldn't let me jump, even though it said light year, but it was 0.2 light years. Yeah. I don't know. I don't know. We'll have to look something like that up. something in your navigation computer and maybe you can put it up. Yeah, as soon you know as I what? get to this place. Maybe I'll put it in and I'll share it with the partner. And maybe that way you'll be able to just click on the bookmark from the squad. I'll try that. I haven't I'll, I don't know. I'll have to figure that out. Be prepared, we're going to the Pleiades system. What the hell was that? We're going to the Pleiades sector, I mean something you can see from your front yard. And you live out in a place where you can get pitch black, don't you? Yeah. Lucky motherfucker. <laughs> We're near a lot of things, but we've got fucking lights in the street. So. Oh yeah, we don't have street lights. <laughs> I have one of my, I have one that's my previous homeowner put in my yard, and the bulb burned out, and I'm not replacing it. I don't want that bright ass thing there. I think I found a chat box that I'm putting on my stream. I added one today, but I didn't like yeah. it because one you put one line in and then it disappeared. Uh -huh. I want the one where it actually has a few lines on it so you can kind of catch up. Yeah, uh, I don't know. I, I You might be able to stretch it out. Well, I found one because uh, I have Streamlabs Gold and there was one on the da in the dashboard. And I just had to download it. So okay. I just have to get rid of the one yeah, I have. Mine does that. Is it pops up there. It's stretched out. It pops up there, but it disappears. Yeah, it disappears. It looks like it holds eight sentences. Yeah. And then yeah. they start disappearing. Which that's better than what I have. The one I have now is it says one, the one thing, and then it disappears. I am at, I'm, I'm almost to a station right now, so I'll be. Uh, actually, I need to go to, let me see if I can. I just added a new chat box, so we'll see how that works. <laughs> 
Yeah. Watch, it'll be the exact same thing. It might be. <laughs> Share with your squadron. Delphi. Even though I had to put all that shit in, it takes me to a system called Delphi. So where do I find that? Um, Under squadrons? You know what? Yes, I would think. Squadrons, maybe new post. Play cycle um, I don't know what the fuck that is. I was going to ask that's you. The, well, everything kind of resets. I mean, the, the territory and stuff doesn't, but the stuff that you've done resets. So, like, you know, when you sneak material to this station to strengthen what the fuck ever, um, it becomes... Er, you have to, um, you, it resets that. So you may, uh, it may be like you lose some rank, or it's not really rank, but you lose some standing. But, I don't know how to explain this. You have to keep up your standing. Right. So you have to keep delivering shit. So, uh, it's in order to get paid more every week. So if you want to get paid a million dollars a week, you got to keep up your your standing to do that. And each week when that resets, all those things reset. They don't reset to the beginning, but they but you drop in standing a little bit. And you got to work it up and get above what you were, and then it drops a little bit. You're still above what you were, but it still drops a little bit. And you got to go and work and get above that you know what i'm saying right what's the name of the system that we're going to because i couldn't find the bookmark anywhere the resonante oh i mean uh we're going to uh it's delphi but i'm i'm looking in the uh squadron thing and i did i shared it with the squadron maybe if you look in your hey look in your uh navigation chart and it may be in there Oh, okay, yeah, it might be under your bookmarks. It might have, it'll have a little uh, squadron symbol next to it. Oh, okay, it does. Does it say Delphi? Yep, that's not how I was fucking spelling it. <laughs> well, that's where we're going, but I'm not, take, I'm not taking my ass there. Oh, you're not? No. Um. Uh, uh, I'm going to try to take my my crate there. Oh, I don't, I don't have any other ships on me. So, do we need battleships or? I don't know. Seventeen uh, jumps in this. I don't have my good frame shift drive in my Anaconda. Yeah. Um. I did find a beluga and a python for sale in my travels today. Yeah. Let me see. Where the fuck am I in the first? Oh, I'm all the way in the fucking in like Vega or some shit. I wonder, I was. Got 
10 ships. What do you got? Federal drop ship. Yeah, I'm just going to, I'm just going to take my ass. So. Okay. Well, all right then, then I will too. Well, that's just all I have. I'm nowhere near Atropos, so. <laughs> right. You know what? Hang on a second. Before we do that, why don't we do this? I don't need to give anything away. Ship released. You are clear for egress. This is probably something we should have on the ass anyway. So why don't you meet me in the Sol system? Are you closer to there? Uh, probably. I have to look on a map. I'm two jumps away, so I'm I'm gonna head that way. Oh. Yeah, I get it, the Rosinante or the Resonante or whatever. Yeah. But that looks like the federal gunship. <laughs> the closest Kinda. thing the closest yeah, thing to I, it. I can see that, yeah. So, I, I mean, it's, it's a Corvette. Uh, <laughs> I mean, they keep calling it a frigate Corvette, a Corvette frigate. I don't know what they mean by that. Those are two different kinds of, but you know, um, so scan that motherfucker. Yeah, I'm two jumps from from the soul system. So am I. So. Frameshift drive rate data. Frameshift drive charging. I am in need of it. Way ahead is clear. Safe travels, Commander. Sixty-six percent rank uh, on warrant officer. Yeah, that's not bad at all. Way, you're gonna be way up there, yeah. I'm gonna stop at uh, Ensign because I'm just mainly wanted to get up to where I could get that ship, and then I'm gonna start working on my Empire because it's going a lot slower now. So the higher rank you get, the slower it's going to get. Sure. Soul system. I'm lagging behind because I'm just scanning late spring ship drive weights. I'm just going to sit here and fuel up. Sure, I don't have any missions on. Okay, good. Last time I was traveling, out, traveling around with missions on me, I kept getting chased by pirates. <laughs> yeah, because you've got data. In your... <laughs> yeah, I was like, yeah. fuck. 
and they caught me in this system, so. <laughs> yeah, they don't give a fuck where you are. Oh, I can go to Titan now. Huh. Europa, that'd be cool to go there. I'm trying to remember where this place was. Oh, oh, I do. Ha I do not have the permit for Triton yet. No, neither do I. So that's what I'm saying. There's something. There's something in, up on. Triton. Triton's got some shit. Let me look up that. You probably gotta be a fucking admiral or something to get there. Or an ensign. Because if you're a warrant officer, if you still can't get there, then I don't know. I wish I knew how to work this Inara site. I really don't. Is a EDDB for some reason. It should be, you know, it ought to be fucking. See, I don't know how you get to Triton because here's the chart that I was looking at. Yeah. And it's not on it. Might be something brand new. Who knows? Yeah, the last, <laughs> the last place you get a permit for is whores. We get one, two, we get three more permits. Like. Vice Admiral and Admiral, you don't get anything for your rank, which is pretty dumb. I mean, that's after reaching the top, you think that you get. Well, maybe, maybe there's, maybe they do add something. You know, maybe that's something that they're waiting to add to. I don't know. Let's see. Let's try Furukawa. We can land on Mercury. You just never wish. Well, let's try, uh. Furukawa Enterprises. It's on. <clears throat> it's on Mercury. So go to Mercury. Oh, I see Mercury. it. I see it now. Okay. And uh, and also while we're there, we can maybe get our uh, SRVs out and go hunting material on the surface since it is metal rich. Maybe that will be helpful. I don't know. Why is it ten thousand light seconds away from a fucking? Where the fuck have I been? Where the fuck am I? I got, I don't know because I got 160 light seconds. I've got seven, you know, what the fuck? Were you just like flying while you were looking? I was. <laughs> you just kept on going. <laughs> I must, I just kept going. I'm flying away from the fucking sun. Uh, you know what else we got to do though, especially with Misty's here. Misty's likes looking at shit we need to figure out how to find voyager yes that would be awesome and misty might be stopping back in and, and yeah. when she does i want to try to go to that galileo station because i tried showing it the other day and i kept getting shot down <laughs> so, i was like i gotta get out of here it's costing me too much money <laughs> 
because you had all that information. Yeah. Oh man, I'm above the ecliptic, so I I like flew straight up from the. I flew galactic <laughs> north. I flew galactic north. I'm looking at there's Earth and there's Venus. Yeah, I'm coming. But once we get parked at Furukawa, maybe we will be able to get our SRVs out and drive around a little bit and see what we can see. Oh, I didn't even think. I might have to buy one. Hopefully this place I can do it. I thought you had one. I wrecked it yesterday. Yeah, I know, but I ended up with one. I think I've still got one. Oh, okay. I wonder if it just takes a while to get it back together. Or something. I don't know, because I couldn't. We'll see. We'll find out. You know, it's weird. Mercury is almost tidally locked with the sun, but it it still spins just real slow. So it still has a day side and a night side. You know, the right. moon the moon has a day side and a night side, but only one side ever faces us because it's locked with us. I'm going to put out some more of those uh, video. I'm, I'm starting another, I say starting. I, I've had this idea for a very long time, but I've got all this information on mythical creatures and things. On uh, like the Grafton monster and stuff like that. Which, before I do that one, I'm going to need your help. <laughs> Local information. <laughs> well, what I want you to do is I want you to take a, a burlap sack <coughs> and a kazoo, and I want you to go outside and uh, bang on these sticks, blow the kazoo, <coughs> and hold the bag. But anyway, no, uh, yeah, get you to get you to fucking. I gotta figure out a way. I'm gonna catch a bus or something. Some really cheap way to get to you. And I'm just gonna come to your house. And we're gonna make, we're gonna get some film. We're gonna be me and you out monster hunting for the grafting monster. I'm gonna make you a local fucking joke. <laughs> All right. Like, oh, that Bobby character. Yeah. I hear he was chasing fucking grafting monsters and shit out here. There's a restaurant. Well, they closed because of COVID and everything. But is they. He ever, is he gonna come back? Probably not. It's, it's around here, it is really hard to keep a business going if you have to shut down for any reason. There was a really popular restaurant in town, and they closed down for uh, just, you know, redoing everything inside. Renovation? Yeah, yeah. and they, they couldn't afford to open back up because of what they lost in the process. And it was like, it sucks because the building's sitting there completely redone. And, and empty. Yeah, and empty. Docking confirmed. Power down your engines. Greetings, Commander. <laughs> Check out your shipyard. This is a big place. Yeah, see, land on the planet ain't so bad if you can fly directly at the space that you yeah. don't have to, like, <laughs> float around to the other side of the planet is fine. Like, I was hurtling towards this thing at the speed of light, and then all of a sudden I was out of glide mode, and okay. Oh, I can get out in my rover at the station. Yeah. What? This is cool. Okay, this is pretty damn awesome. 
Yeah, see, that's what I'm saying. Maybe we can take a little time to run around. You go one way, I'll go the other. And let's see what we can find in way of... Uh, and put me in a garage? That's, I mean, that's... Yeah. Yeah, this is pretty awesome. What I'm trying to see is... Go to your outfit. I'm going to replace my shield booster here because if I get to the point where I need that shield booster, I'm dead anyway. Be cool if I could find my ship at this damn station. <laughs> yeah. Well, it's in it's parked, you know. Trying to find my way out of the station. Damn. This place is fucking huge. He's, I'm picking up the drones as white blocks right now, so it's like tricking me. <laughs> I was like, oh, it's something over. Nope, it's moving. Yeah, they didn't have too much in there. It was a federal drop ship. There's something flying right over me. Oh, I think I just yeah. ship landed. Okay. Yeah, you're near, uh, you're near the base. So. <laughs> yeah, I invited you twice. He said, fuck oh, you. No, you're looking up shit. <laughs> so. Yeah, I probably want to do that. There's no beacon when you're on the you're in the SRV. No, uh, go up to the um, 
Go up to the wing and go down to options and turn on wing beacon. Oh, well, shit. Okay. I don't know. I just thought maybe since the planet's metal rich, maybe we well, might be able to find some shit. Yeah, I got something up ahead of me. Bronzite. Whatever it is, you're going to need it. <laughs> even if you don't need it even if it's not what you're looking for right this second you're gonna need it Handbrake is on. yeah we got Nichols's little yellow shirt with we gave him the Captain Kirk shirt you know and Mrs. Grover's Mill has the science shirt has the blue one and of course, I've got the red shirt. <laughs> You're screwed. <laughs> I, intend, I intend to die several times in the video. I'm hoping to get some uh, Vulcan ears to put on uh, Mrs. Grover's mill. Oh, that'd be awesome. I used to do, me and her both were, <clears throat> we were actors in our local, I say local, at the, there's a place called the Cat's Haunted Warehouse every year for, for Halloween, you know, and we were actors in it, and um, we had a lot to do with theater and high school and all that stuff, you know, like, but we learned how to do makeup a lot, like, like, I could give you a third boobie if you want a third boobie. <laughs> I've done that before, so. Yeah, there's spaceships above us, so we keep seeing fucking spaceships. But the, but the, uh, the Vulcan ears would be real easy to do, because I've got the latex and stuff. Yeah, latex is something I've always thought would be cool to get into, but there's an yeah, art to that. You can, get, you can buy gallons of it, too, and it's, and there's something else you need. Gallons of KY jelly, believe it or what? not. What? Yeah, trust me. <laughs> trust me. You need gallons of KY jelly if you're doing monster stuff. You know, if you're doing stuff like, you know, putting a scar or something like that, that's one thing, but monsters and things like that. Tons of KY jelly. Well, I don't think, I'm not finding shit. Are you? Yeah, I just found another one. You did? Well, I'm just not far enough away then. Yeah, I had to travel good ways. Well, when you get to the back to the station, Look at your utility mounts. Find the utility mount you'd like to live, that you could live without, and trade it for the Xeno scanner. For a Xeno scanner? Yeah. Is that where we're headed? Who said that? I didn't oh, say that. Oh shit! I'm just saying that an ass needs a Xeno scanner. This is right. <laughs> oh, well, Misty needs to get back on here. I know. <laughs> I don't know how to get a message to her though. Ah, uh, she was tending to the kids. Ah, fucking some Dayquil. So give him some. No, no, not Dayquil. Give him some <laughs> not Nyquil. The other one. <laughs> the give other one. The other one. Yeah, give him some Nyquil. Give him a little cough syrup, if you know what I mean. And I think you do. That and she said that she woke up at three in the morning this morning. <laughs> so. oh, well. I was thinking that whenever we get our poop in a group about podcasts, yeah, we should, I don't know, figure out some kind of schedule, but like one time, 
We all be on Misty's podcast. I mean, we're not we're not streaming at the same time. You know what I'm saying? Just let her stream it, and that's what the podcast is, right? And we advertise our channels, of course. Then you do one, and it'll be under whatever whatever subject matter you want to talk about. You know, you want to talk about Elite Dangerous, so we'll we'll talk for an hour or two hours on Elite Dangerous. You know what I'm saying? With bullshit in between. <laughs> right, whatever, whatever we, you know, we have a guideline. It's just a guideline, you know. But then, um, you know, but we, we have time to prepare because we need to all prepare for whatever. We're she about. is working on her logo right now. Oh, is she? Yeah, she said she thought she made herself one, but she didn't. <laughs> oh. Okay. So, but she says she has a program for it, and she's going to try to do it. Okay, no, but what I was saying, though, is if we talk about whatever subject we want to talk about, and then, like, when it's Misty's, it's Misty's thing, then, uh, we, only Misty is the one. So we joined the host. So we're not, we're, yeah, we joined them, and we're not splitting audience. You know what I'm saying? No, that's, that's legit, and, yeah. And then, uh, you know, you, it's your turn. We, we talk about whatever subject matter we want to talk about. We can even all, we call it the same podcast. It's the same podcast because it's the same group of people. You know what I mean? But, uh, and then when we go to mine, you know, everybody's on, you know, as a guest on mine, we talk about whatever subject matter I want to talk about. You know what I'm saying? I don't know. It's just I'm spitballing. I'm spitballing. That's here. not a bad idea because then it gets your community all in the same place too because then they can even talk right. in the chat to each other more than exactly exactly and that's why that's what i was saying you know and then when you're with crimson just fucking just hold on to your butts crimson will be like let's talk about how vikings can do the world good right now be like i have no idea what to say to this Not seeing anything else out here. Oh boy. We're not even that far from the station. That's fucked up. Oh shit, I've been driving off cars. Cargo 
So yeah, we're gonna have to we're gonna have to incorporate the words the code word the code phrase donkey balls onto our Ah <laughs> yes. <laughs> <laughs> it's been all right so far i'm still trying to figure out what the fuck's going on exactly but the politics are weird in it because i mean well, they're dealing I, with a bunch of different yeah, places i mean i know I, I don't know who the good guy's supposed to be really they all suck in their own way yeah and then you kind of yeah, understand I, I each of them that. yeah i so. get that and that's but i just saying that oh fuck what i hear I'm just saying that um, I I don't know. I'm trying to get past the part that they're all fighting for water because that just wouldn't be happening. <laughs> I mean, it just wouldn't be. You, you, your water is very recyclable. It is very very recyclable, and and not only that, it's fucking everywhere. So it's like that. They might make money on that water, bringing that water, but the same way. Nestle Quick or Nestle Company makes water on, makes money on bottled water. You know, it's like nothing wrong with that. I'm just saying that it's not fucking gold, and it wouldn't be. And so I'm just trying to get. I'm trying to. Look, well, I'm trying to spin my disbelief. Well, and there's one part of it, and it's not really a spoiler, but they actually explain a little bit of the water issue. Yeah. Uh, Mars is buying most of water. Because yeah, they're they're terraforming they and they're trying to have their own seas and oceans and everything. So yeah, they're, yeah, I've that's said that. That is, okay, and uh, you know, so that's like the huge thing. It's not really the drinking water part. Is they're trying to, you know, there's people that are on Mars to hope to live to see the day where there's actual water on right. Mars, even right. though they know they won't. Because they all live under domes, right? Yeah, now. right. It's a. Uh, and they actually they do a good job to make you feel bad for the like, Martians because they're never all the Martians that are alive during the show they're never going to see their planet done because it's going right. to take. They're never going to see an ocean. Sure. Right. So and then uh, they really make you dislike people from Earth because they they have everything yeah, that they everyone's do, wanted. But, they, but I mean, fuck! It's like you know. I, that's perfect podcast material there too. Everyone watch this show. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> like, well, it could be, it could be that, yeah. I mean, that's like, but yeah, I mean, that's it's like the new season. The politics get a little goofy, and uh, without ruining everything, it's kind of like you sit there and like, oh, what the fuck? You know, it's, come on, yeah. <laughs> so, yeah. So, so, don't do that. Well, there's a there's a guy that I I. Uh, 
I'm going to try to say, trust his instinct. His thing is, or he's the critical thinker. Oh, yeah. And he had said, one of the reasons I decided to start watching the show is because he said that I feel like an asshole for not watching the show sooner. You know? No, honestly, because uh, when I first started watching it, I was like, I'll, I'll try. And then I know. started watching it, I'm like, dude, I'm like, I'm like two seasons into it now. I'm binge watching this motherfucker. It's like, what the hell? Well, we've got, we're trying to keep it. We are kind of in a way binge watching it, but um, we, I, I, I like, okay, as dumb as it sounds, you know, I like the fact that the Mandalorian comes on once a week. I like the fact that that happens. Uh, because that's the way I was I well, used to it. This one does too. Person. This one's weekly. Yeah, I think it's every uh, the expanse. I think it comes out every every Thursday. Oh yeah. Yeah, so that's why I'm I'm not watching it cuz I like to binge watch. <laughs> so, sure. So I'm not watching too many of them unless I get bored and I'm like, "Oh fuck, it, I'll watch it." Right. So. See, I I like um, I don't mind it coming out because for us it, it gives us a, uh, what am I picking up? I can't see. It says, um, it gives me some, uh, reason, um, I'm, 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 I'm trying to do five fucking things at one time. <laughs> the, uh, uh, it's something for me and my whole family to look forward to. Right. And I remember a day when, uh, oh, I have a funny story about this too. But when me and uh, my dad used to wait for uh, the Godzilla movies to come on Channel 25 and so that we can uh, have the little... Godzilla movie marathon night there at the house and that was it was incredible because it's like it's like you just don't kids today won't know that you had to go to the bathroom when the commercials were on right it's <laughs> you know you just didn't know you know you just pause the shit now and that's incredible and it's, it's wonderful it's a great thing it's one of those reasons I say, say that you know the good old days aren't necessarily in every way the good old days that you might be thinking of, you know, so there's more to it than that and um, you know there's everything we do today, even 2020, I would rather there be a pandemic in 2020 than have there be a pandemic in 2005 right, I would rather that stuff exist now, not, not then, because what would we have done without as ready and available internet as there is now. We couldn't say, talk yeah, to 2005, I had HughesNet, which was fucking horrible. There's no way I could have done half the shit I did. Right. <laughs> right. Well, and that's kind of my point, you know, is it's like. Oh, got some sulfur. Uh, big ass rock keeping me from picking it up. Yeah, you have to travel out of ways to find shit, but this is a good place to come, I think. Yeah, I'm in the crater now. It seems like I'm finding a few things. Except there also comes to the point where you need some... Manganese. You have to have, you have, to have the uh, information. Frame shift drive and and whatever things you have to have different stuff to other than just material I mean all oh, this shit I can't pick up because it's actual cargo oh, oh it's really? material it's Hold on a second. Let me check my cargo now. You you can fill up particular type, types of material, too. Oh, no. I don't know why I'm not picking it up, then. Oh, you can fill up on certain ones? 
So if I have you, I think you have space for like two hundred each. Oh, I don't have that many. Yeah. Oh, it was just being goofy. Okay. Yeah. See, like, uh, yeah, basic conductors. I have three of three hundred. Is how many I can have. Uh, cadmium, cadmium, I can have two hundred. Carbon. We have two hundred all these. We'll be upgrading everything. Right. Well, and like I say, you got to have information as well. It's not just right. I'm headed back towards the ship. Yeah. I'm a lot further away than you, so I'll be there in a minute. Hopefully I don't wreck because I'm down to, oh shit, 28%. Yeah, be careful. This place said low gravity, but it must have more gravity than the other places, because... Well, it might be high low gravity. You know what I mean? It's, it doesn't have to be... Yeah, because it's uh, beating me up a lot more than I usually do. <laughs> you know, there's like low, low gravity where you might hit a bump and you will throw yourself off the planet. Off the rock. Of course I had to go down to this crater and not to be gentle before I just gun it and go. <laughs> yeah, that's why you gotta be gentle now. <laughs> what did you learn, Crimson? What did you learn? <laughs> the bee will sting. Yeah. Oh, I got another rock right here. I think though that we should do it in a on a Discord Brady Bunch kind of go. You know what I mean? Yeah. <laughs> and, and I'd like to have you know, like for mine, I would think that there might be if I wanted to talk about a movie, I could have a set of clips ready to play because you could play clips. You know, you have a set of clips ready to play or. Or pictures, not even clips, just pictures to remind you of what I'm talking about. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Like if we were to talk about the movie Alien. You know, we have an Alien podcast. Um, we, I could, I could have a, I could just, uh, on, I even on the fly look up pictures that I want you to see and put them in the middle Brady Bunch square, you know. I don't know. I don't know. At some point, we'll get all of us together and talk to Misty and Crimson and everybody about it and see. I hope that's your dot I'm driving towards. I think it's blue. Uh, it is. <laughs> but, um,. I'm driving towards Perkashua, go fuck you. Okay, I am too. I just marked it. I'm so far away, your guys' dots are like right next to each other. <laughs> um, can you come? Wait a minute. Never mind. I'm on my feet again. Okay. I rolled over and I couldn't move. Yeah, I'm a long ways from you, so... <laughs> I'm the tur turtle on my back. Yeah, I'm going towards Furukawa. Surprise. 24%. Let's see how this works. I 
I know when I'm at nine percent and take one shot from a federal gunship, I I die. <laughs> yeah, probably, yeah. You probably been taking one shot from a federal gunship and died. Anyway, but... Oh, by the way, you can scan ships and shit if you can target them. Oh, while on the river? Yeah, you can get the same information that becomes a commodity later. Or that's a commodity now for us. Using it to uh, engineer our ships. Budge. Oh shit. Yeah. Jody with the follow, thank you so much. Welcome. Or Judy, I'm sorry. I'm trying to not die in the read at the same time. I'm not very good. <laughs> Multitasking. <laughs> kilometers away <laughs> from me from no from the fuck you what enterprise yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. hey there's two crash ships here nice Four mega meters away but <laughs> mega, yeah mega meters why do I have Okay, I'm creeping now. I just rolled. So, I'll be there eventually. I'm at 5%. <laughs> ah, man. It's like it looks flat. Oh, rock. Yeah, it's not flat. <laughs> it's bright, but it's not flat. sure how we get back on board our ship but. hopefully I don't have to find that hangar because I don't know where the fuck I was you're at five percent you're not gonna have to you're just gonna end up on it. Uh -uh, I'm making it <laughs> I got this right. challenge accepted Shit, as soon as I got out of the gates, I was down to 86%. <laughs> so. Oh, 
fire zone. I'm in the area at least. Do what? I've got anonymous access. I got fucked up, and I don't know. I asked for I docking request granted. I don't know the... Yeah. Oh, you have to ask for permission to dock? I don't know. Dawson with the follow. Thank you. Welcome. my ship. And I'm assuming there's a freaking garage there that I can drive into, but I'm not, I forget exactly how that works. But for some reason, I did, I did something to piss them off, because I did something to get, uh, Did you use your gun within the boundary? I don't, I might have. Oh uh, yeah, yeah, you just drive into this one. Just follow where your ship is. Okay. And then uh you go down to the roll panel. And then the ship. Yeah. You had to ask permission though to get in there or uh, I I don't know that I had to. So I would just go toward your ship where you see your, your ship and uh, see if you can just, uh, see if you can just get in. Four percent. I'm so close. You were so close. <laughs> I'm getting there. <laughs> we got this. <laughs> we'll stay. We'll stay. <laughs> Even on Wreckfest, my good driving happens whenever I'm down to like 6%. <laughs> I, I said,
So remember, on Mercury is where we can buy some Xeno things. That's pretty awesome that we're able to drive around on Mercury, though. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, and, and it, was, it wasn't a waste of time. You know, it, it, it just wasn't a waste of time. It was actually stuff for us to find. of a ramp. I guess no, I'm going up a ramp. Uh, you weren't. You weren't. Uh, you could go on it and then you'll come back down one. You'll be kind of in the middle. Just okay. follow where you see your ship. You'll get closer to the center of that thing and you'll find your ship. Eventually it'll pop up there. We can get collection limits here and decontamination limits. my ship. Oh, 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 I think I'm there. I found it on accident. And you just drive up into the garage that looks like you're kind of driving at your at your ship. Does your light light up whenever you're under it? No, it'll say uh, that you're ready to board. It's telling me to leave settlement. I asked for a requ request permission to dock. Anonymous. Anonymous access. Request permission to dock. Yeah. Proceed to garage. Maybe that was it. Maybe that same thing happened to me. Maybe I you should have asked whenever I. Sorry. I don't know. Oh no. Okay. I thought I lagged just now. Nah. Oh, I'm in the wrong garage. You are. <laughs> that was like the next one over. ship I think I was under your ship to be honest because it was the solid right. block not the hollow block no no shit the so, second beaver's online oh man I don't know if I'm going to have time to I'm going to start going right now so what do I need utility um, mounts Utility mounts. Find something you can live without. I have three empty spots. Okay, fill it up with a with a Xeno scanner. All three of them? No, just one. Okay. And then you'll have to set it like a. You'll have to give it a firing group too. Oh no, they weren't empty. I, I was reading wrong. The shield boosters, I should be okay. Uh, yeah. Do I, I got rid of a shield booster in my ship because I, I mean, they've never helped me that much before, so I'm really not that worried about them. 
Now, does it work automatic once I put it in the firing group or? Put it in the firing group, like put it in two, you gotta pull the, the left button, you know. All right, you leaving here already? Yeah, I'm. I'm gonna get to where we're going because I think that there's a space station there. Okay, and so. yeah, tonight I was gonna go play uh, Fallout seventy six with cats and nipples. Oh. Uh, but she doesn't get off till eleven, and so I'm gonna see if I can have enough time to to get to where we're going so that. We can do the Xeno hunting later and just get there. That way you can get on there with her. Sure. Well, I'm waiting on her to call me, too. So, you know, she, she's just not going to be right at 11. But there's a station there, and I think it's called something Oak. I wrote it down. Daughter's Oak. And we want to be sure and, and land there and do all the stuff there just in case, just in case shit goes wrong. All right. Okay. Oh, I did get a fine, but it's, I got a fine for zero credits. You did? Yeah. See, I don't know what it is. I don't know what it is. God, you know what movie I want to buy? What's that? Fucking Dread. Oh, yeah. The one with uh, Carl Urban is Judge Dread. And there was no point, at, at no point in that movie does Judge, does Carl Urban say he's got to take his mask off so that you can see it's him. You know what I mean? Like, right. like anybody else, like, like fucking Sylvester Stallone, he took his helmet off. Poor shit, damn it. You're playing the part of Dread. Dread doesn't take his helmet off. There's no, what do you call it, ego boost in it. You know what I'm saying? Like, that would be an ego thing. You know, Stallone had to have his mask off. Not once do you see all of Carl Urban's face in that. It's 13 jumps away from me. What is it for you? 17. Really? Have you, you haven't done anything? I haven't done much with it because I haven't had the material. Oh, right, right, right. See, I'm up to third level now. Got full first and second, so now I'm only I'm 13 jumps away from it. See, that's what, that's what I mean, though. That tells you exactly... how good that is though. All right. Yeah, we want to go to that Donner's Oak so that we can sell, uh, sell whatever uh, cartographics you pick up. Oh, I haven't sold any of mine today. I've been scanning you're, everywhere too. You're probably you probably fucking well off, man. You're probably gonna get some shit then.
That's another thing too, you know, the sun is the only known natural object in the universe. I mean, you know, our sun is the closest for us to make it. That we know of that is as close to a perfect sphere as it could possibly be. No shit. The sun is, yeah. Now there may be other stars out there that are more close, but you know, we can only really measure our sun in that manner so yeah the only natural object like that and of course that that nice friendly ball in the sky you look at it through infrared you look at it through um, different points in the spectrum and you realize it's a raging tiger man <laughs> it looks like you know what we see is a nice friendly ball of warmth <laughs> not so fast <laughs> As soon as I came out of fucking my jump, it put me right into the gravity of this store. I'm not cooking though, it's a dead one. <laughs> well, those those smaller ones have a bigger atmosphere. You know, it's like uh Frameshift drive charging. This one's not a fucking it's a yellow star, but I can't get the uh, fuel off of it. I was able to jump right out of the fucking atmosphere of it. <laughs> so, yeah. fuck it. I'm a little warm now, but... I mean, when you think about it, we are all in the atmosphere of the sun. Yeah. You know, because... Uh, even Jupiter and shit, you know? Oh, this Charging. game makes me think about all the shit I've ever learned about astronomy. All the dumb, useless information I've ever learned. I'm going to food you down on everybody. Shift drive charging. Are there any fucking fuel stars out here? Yeah, I mean, I'm <laughs> filling up right now. 
I'm a half I a tank. Kind of glad, I mean, I'm kind of glad that I put a heat sink on this ship, though. Because, uh, I'm able to, whenever it builds up high enough, I can launch that heat sink and give myself some more time to correct. Alright, I want to hang out here for a little bit. Fill up. Before we start trying to get to Sagittarius A, though, we need to figure out how we can travel together. Right. We can Raiden, what's up? Forward. Hello, Raiden. Hopefully tomorrow I'll get my YouTube stuff set up so that I'm hope I'm hoping to to stream Friday on YouTube this time. I'm trying to figure out how to get the uh, Discord cameras on my stream to where. If we we're all chatting on Discord with yeah, our cameras, now, and... say for okay, now say for a um, for a, a podcast type thing, I would take I would uh, take my my uh, my Discord screen, make it full screen, and move it over to my my capture screen. Right. So well, screen like like my... how I did that test stream the other day when we were all on our. Yeah, I pretty much cropped. I cropped out all the panels and shit on Discord, and uh, just had it to where the cameras were just showing. Right. Yeah. Yeah. See, now I I want to figure out how to do that with uh, the four of us in there, and but I still want to be able to put my stuff on there. I still want to put the the girl Grover's Mill tab at the top. I think it'll be okay. Oh um, yeah, yeah. Well, see, all I did was exactly what you said. I moved my Discord window over to my capture screen right and, and then, then I, you just hide i'll hide my freaking i have a frame around my face up there you know yeah i just made i made my camera my normal camera i, I turned the eyeball off because you're seeing my camera on discord and <laughs> so i just you're turned seeing, i just turned that one off we were seeing your camera on discord yeah, like whenever we had, when I put, when me, you, and Crimson were in here, and I just yeah. did that little test, uh -huh. I uh, made it to where all my stuff was normal, uh -huh. except for I turned my camera off. Like, I just went down to, uh, fuck, I don't even know what that's called, webcam, and hit the eyeball. Oh, uh, okay. Yeah, 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 you just, okay, yeah. That's what I was saying. Is I do the same thing with like the frame. I just hit the eyeball. It turns that off. Right. Turns the. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. That's what I'm saying. Uh, hang on a second. I got a pat on my nose. See, I, I'm not a big fan of Twitch. Um, I've been, like right now, I'm multi-streaming. I'm doing Facebook and YouTube. And uh, Grover's going to be streaming on YouTube. He's, he just told me uh, Friday, for Friday the 13th. He's going to try to be. So, Twitch, I, mean, I tried Twitch 
I wasn't a fan. I mean, they're they're strict on. They're just as strict as Facebook is, but with their own things. Fuel scoop disengaged. Frameshift drive charging. And I figured something out too. You know, you're you're afraid that your your blue yeti is gonna hear you fart. Four, three, <laughs> two, I've got this. I've got this uh, thing from. New Year's Eve party, so anytime I fart, I'm just gonna do this. <laughs> it's a little party, it's a little party noisemaker, so anytime I gotta fart, from now on, I'm just gonna go. Yeah, Raiden just said he was thinking about starting to stream again and using Twitch. I told him that we were also using YouTube. He's, he's thinking about using YouTube too. Yeah, look into yeah. it. I, I have, I just, I, I can't, I don't know. I, None of these places are friendly, I don't think, to any of us. But Twitch is especially not. And I, I just don't see that being um, being the kind of place I want to be. And I've already got a YouTube channel all set up and everything. And I'm assuming that Raiden has subscribed to Grover's Mill on YouTube. <laughs> You know what? And I also put a public thing on my uh, Patreon page today that everybody should go check out. Including you, Beaver. Shit, I have your page up. <laughs> you what? I have your page up. I just haven't looked at it. I've been copying oh. pasting. <laughs> well, uh. Yeah. You I'll don't want to You don't want to check it out on your stream because it's music, so. Oh, I got you. your Wi-Fi lets you, who do you, wait, oh, your home Wi-Fi, that sucks, it says one nice thing is, you know, I'm in a small town, but, but we've got inter, a cable. yeah, it's, uh, <laughs> Wi-Fi is not an issue, Only thing that sucks is to have Wi-Fi. I have to have Comcast, and I don't really watch TV that much. Right. So I have to pay like fucking fuck. I think I pay See, like two eighty a month for cable, and just I, to I, have the good internet. Yeah, I don't pay. For, we don't pay for cable. We just pay for the internet. Yeah. See, if I want it, they they trick you into it. Oh, well, they fuck you into it. Yeah. Yeah. The, in order to get the best internet package, you have to have their cable package. If I only got the internet, then I can only get the lesser uh, package for the internet. So I wouldn't have as much info, uh, data. Right. And it's like, <laughs> that's fucked up. That's, yeah. <laughs> I don't know this place we're going we might want to do missions from here I haven't really looked in the at this dollar place it might be a great place to do it might be a great place that we should start you know what I mean like another home away from home kind of thing you know we might right. if we build up rep here we might be able to get some really good missions <laughs> fam really just invited do. me to party I'm not even <laughs> On Xbox uh, chat. Uh, <laughs> so, is, he, is, he in the, is he in the stream? Uh, no, I'd say no. Looks like you and Raiden are. Okay. Dang, yeah.
But yeah, in a way, that uh, expanse is almost like a movie version of an each game. Right? I, I mean, swear, those there. people probably played this game. <laughs> yeah, oh, I'm sure they have. The <laughs> game came out in like 1982. Yeah, it's just... <laughs> It's an old, old, old concept of a game, you know. Two more jumps. I got plenty of fuel. Okay. Frameshift drive charging. Trying to copy and paste and do the jumps and get fuel at the same time and I'm like I'm gonna crash I'm almost at Delphi, and it is 26 light years away from Oh, you yeah, actually, you had a router issue, and your new router still fucked up. See, that's fucked up. You know, if I'm paying for a service, and your equipment's not doing its job, you're, you're replacing it. <laughs> so I'm almost there, Grover. <laughs> Oh, I'm, I'm just, I've got one more jump, so. Oh, me too. I'm looking at Delphi right now. Yeah, I'm, I'm, I but I'm making a 26.6 light year jump. Nice. The most I can do, I think, is 23. I sure how. I'm about to look and see what it says. What's the place we're going to? Delphi? No, the, uh... You said there's a station we yeah, want to stop at? I think it's Donner's Oak. I think it's Donner's Oak. I'm not, I'm not sure exactly. we we'll get there and we'll see. Um, oh, I'm about to pop in right now. Here I am. No, I don't see that one. I'll go through it again. <laughs> Daddy Pig Shop. <laughs> yeah. Donner's Oak. I'm going to Donner's Oak. Uh, it might be there. one of my unexplored areas. It's out there. Um, I've never been here in this ship either. I don't know. You might. Uh, you know, we'll see if I can read is there a, uh, it's down the list of ways. It's about 1,300 uh, light seconds away. But it's on there. It's on the list. You, you can't miss it. I've never been here either, so. Holy shit, my, my damn menu keeps updating, adding things as I'm going, and it's like fucking with me. Yeah, yeah. Slow down to a stop and, and see if you can find it that way. Because sometimes as you go along, it'll detect the other stuff.
Do you see it though? No, I'm still place? looking. There it is. Holy fuck, it's down there. Yeah. It's not too terribly far away, it just seems it. They're known for a shitty Wi Fi, but they're the only option yet. Yeah, see, that's what sucks. It's the only option you have. <laughs> Don't forget to sell your. Uh, yes, I'll sell it here. Graphics when you get here. Yeah. He asked for an invite to the party. Man, we're not on that. <laughs> yeah. We're, we're, we're using uh, uh, Discord right now because we're trying to get used to using it uh, for a multitude of reasons. But Yesterday we had to do it because fucking. The chat kept cutting out. The chat wouldn't work. Yeah. <laughs> it was horrible. <laughs> I know. But, uh, I wish I could uh, share out my, I, as soon as I'm able to, I'll share out my uh, Discord server and you can share yours. I don't know how to, that's what I'm going to have to, I don't understand. We're, we're I can't having to mess through. with it and figure it out, Raiden. Yeah. We apologize. If you know anything about Discord, if you're good with Discord, man, we could use your help. But. Yeah, absolutely, because it took me we fucking 10 minutes to, to figure out how to turn my fucking mic on just to do the chat today. Right. Yeah, I was like, what the right. fuck? But see, I didn't have to make you admin or anything, Grover. Like, you weren't muted whenever you came into my party. Right, but I haven't tried to uh, put my video, video right. on there gotcha, yet. Gotcha, gotcha. Let me get parked and I will. He <laughs> said, nope, no, nothing about it. <laughs> Neither do we. <laughs> We're learning. But we do want to start doing podcasts and then uh, that's in the future, hopefully. Yeah, we're, we're spitballing it right now. So be sure and sign up or subscribe to Mama's Refuge and Trek and Beaver's YouTube channel and Grover's Mill YouTube channel. Does Crimson have a YouTube channel? No, he doesn't. I'm 25 light seconds away. I'm almost there. Awesome, man. Thank you. He said he'll subscribe later. <laughs> Throw down links in there so that everybody sees them, you know? Yeah, I already threw them down. Oh, okay, yeah. There you go. <laughs> I didn't throw mine down. I haven't. I can't find where I can copy and paste mine. Well, Because yeah, when I get in there, it's a user one, and it's like, ugh, fuck. When you get, when you get to 100 uh, uh, subscribers, you can put in, you can make a... See? Now, that's why, because I... I copied and pasted them on before, and it came up looking just like yours. Yeah, I don't know. And it was the name. And then it even, whenever I set it up, it even asked me what I wanted it to look like. Yeah. I, I don't know. I had to I had to wait till I had 100 subscribers before I could do it. So. Yeah, I'm nowhere near that. I think I have eight I'm, or nine. I might have gotten <laughs> screwed on that, you know.
Oh, this is a cool looking station. Yeah. Yeah, they're all, uh, some of them look the same, they're standard type of shape and size. But uh, some of them they get fancy with. I've seen a, like a science station that looked real weird. Access granted. Please on docking bay 3-8. I don't even know if it's still there or not because it seemed like it never, whenever I saw it, it was in the middle of a of kind of a destructive phase. Something was happening to it that was alien in origin. You know? They got any good ships in this one? No. no, they do not have a they do not have a shipyard. Oh what the hell? With a big station like this yeah. one. <laughs> yeah, it's I, it's just not the kind of station it is, I guess. The only thing I could think of. Well that Delphi system is gonna sell for three hundred and sixty one thousand credits once we get twenty light years away but uh, Oh that's a big ass ship right there. Landing gear deployed. I don't even know what that one was. That was a big fucking ship. None of these people are a faction that have anything to do with, you know, what's this called? So it's like, you can do missions for him here, but you're not going to up your rank. Right? So it can be with one more. <laughs> that motherfucker's always online. He's always online. <laughs> uh, fam, we're actually on Discord. Because <laughs> so, we've been having problems with uh, Xbox's chats. That's why I didn't get you an invite. We're actually chatting through Discord. We're trying to make it. We're trying. We're trying to learn Discord so that we we can prepare for our future. Thanks for the share, man. <laughs> Damn it. <laughs> yeah. Oh yeah, Delphi is a big dollar one. All right. Now I wonder what else is in the system though. There's Donner's Oak. I'm not counting another thing. Listening post. Don't know what that is. Low class science vessel. I don't know what that is. Yeah, I went to one of those uh, vessels like that, and it's just a ship, and you can't even do anything with it. You scan it, that's it. That's it. Well, maybe scanning it is a good thing, because maybe that would get you some information. I don't know. There's a I got Grover's parcel. Oh, did he? Did he? Did he get it? <laughs> good. Tell him, now, now you can see shit in 3D. Oh, that yeah, yeah, I got one right here. He even put a little beaver on it. Ah, <laughs> uh, the Oracle. Ooh, I wonder what that is. <laughs> Alright, well, now that I've done that, and I have definitely have been docked at this station, I am going to launch, go into Super Cruise, and I'm going to start looking for unknown signal sources. Yeah, I tried playing this game, fam, with the, the glasses on. Number one, I had to take my glasses off, so I'm blind. 
And then you I'm. Can't just... play this, man. <laughs> hey, fam, fam, listen, man. Uh, go to Google, Google uh, 3D comic page under images, and look at the um, look at that with the 3D glasses on, and it's incredible how well it works. It really works. Like you'll pull up, a, there'll be a, a Lone Ranger page or like a Mighty Mouse or something, and you can look at that on your computer with your 3D glasses on, and you will be able. To, it's it's really, it's amazing how well that works. Oh, you know what? In fact, being outside this space station, we should both scan wakes. Go show your kids. <laughs> yeah, no, absolutely. And Nick Rush had his birthday party, and I gave all the kids a pair of uh, uh, 3D glasses. I sh should have shamelessly put it the website or anything, but I, ah, oh, man, those wakes disappear. If have, you don't get to them. Has fam found out about uh, you doing YouTube for a little bit? I don't know. I don't know, fam. If, Fam knows that. Yeah, fam. Uh, if you want to check Grover out here for a little while, check out his YouTube page, which hopefully he will be streaming on soon. And I'm dropping the links right now for both of them and his Patreon. Yeah, that's. No, uh, not right now. He. Uh, he, he got a little pee pee whacking, and it's yeah. a bullshit pee pee whacking. It's uh, <laughs> you go for it, Robert. I, I, uh, I, yeah, um, <laughs> they um, they I was trying to uh, appeal a thing where they had said that that I was playing music on the channel and. I was breaking copyright law, and if I wanted to appeal it, you just click this button. And I said, yeah, I, I want to appeal that, because it wasn't like I was really in trouble. I just wanted to appeal it and say, no, that's not what was going on. And uh, when I did that, 15 minutes later, they uh, gave me a 30-day ban on my personal page, so I can't do anything with Grover's Mill right now. And that means I can't, you know, like like I say, you know, I've said before, I rely on that. The only way that I can contribute to my family is the revenue from my streams and from Patreon. So that's why I, I want to Tell everybody there's a dollar there's a dollar button on the on, on the Patreon page, you know, and um, yeah. So I don't know. Like I say, I gotta laugh or else I'll cry. Hopefully, in 30 days, I'll be able to come back on there. But I I may I may just put a lot more time into YouTube than I have been doing than I have Facebook. Does that make sense? Yeah, because you were the reason you got into Facebook was to advertise your YouTube channel. It is. So, it is the reason. And then the Facebook took off. <laughs> so, so. And then, yeah, uh, I don't know. I don't know what it was. I mean, literally, it was literally 15 minutes after I appealed that that they suddenly said what they said was that i had shared a uh, that i had shared a uh, uh nudity something with nudity in it and i've never shared anything with nudity in it and they won't show it to you they won't tell you. they just said that and that was it they, they had a little link i could click but i couldn't click it it was you know whatever it was was gone they gave me a 30-day ban for it and I have no idea what it was, except that I might have sent, you know, like I might send Trek and Beaver a titty in the in the in a message, 
you know, but I would never have shared something like that on my Facebook page. So I don't know what to say about that other than I'm not saying that they got pissed and was kind of, you know, but I don't know. It's just, it's bullshit. It's, it's, it's a real big coincidence that they, 15 minutes after I appealed something, they right. decided to go digging through my, my messages because they don't have to, there's no fourth amendment on Facebook. You give that up whenever you sign, when you, you say you agree to their community standards. So when you do that, um, they can look through your messages too. So I don't know. I mean, I can imagine, I don't know when the last time might've been, but I imagine that I could have shared some nudity to like Crimson or somebody, you know, somebody who would never have like said, Oh, this offends me. And you know what I mean? It just isn't what would have happened. Facebook is borderline infringing lately. Oh yeah. Well, <laughs> But they, they, can they do. are, but you give up your rights whenever you say you want to be, uh, you want to be a part of their page, and so. Um, but it's something two people that they shouldn't got, be allowed to do. But two people do. keep getting banned. One got locked out for a comment from July. Yeah, that's the thing. They can go clear back from when you started your account, right? If they want to. If that's, so that's the case, I'll see you guys in like three years because I'm fucked. <laughs> right. Well, I mean that's that's what's happened to me, and it's and I'm not the only one. I'm finding out it's many, 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 many people, but um, but yeah, encoded emission threat zero. Oh, well, there another. Non-human signal source. Threat level seven. Where the fuck are you? <laughs> um, just start scanning shit. I am. I haven't found that one yet. Non-human signal source. I'm flying to it right now. All right, I'm back here a ways. Do you see where I am, maybe? Yeah, I see you. Okay, well, maybe you can detect whenever I come out, pop out of you should just find one yourself when you fight because for your stream it'll be better if you just find one yourself there's they're all over the place you'll, you'll find a non encoded emissions oh oh that's a lot of destroyed ships Fudge crackers. Hello. <laughs> do, 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 do. <laughs> I am Zeno scanning him. I know. I'll never get monetized. <laughs> That's the thing, though. If, if they don't look into you, then they won't find it. But because they can't check everybody. Grover, remember the warning I got for greeting you the one stream? Right. Uh, well, rem remember uh, Lexi got uh, like a 30 day ban for saying something fucked up in my stream. It wasn't fucked up as far as I'm concerned. She just said something funny. And they got rid of her. Remember, they did the same thing to Taco because Taco had said something about uh, Hang on, I'm watching. Are you at the weapons fire? Maybe. Oh, I see you. Braden said he said head. what's up and he got a warning yeah oh yeah 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 I do remember that because I was thinking what the fuck but it ain't just it ain't just me it ain't just us it's a lot of different people that that's happening to 
Ooh, I see a black box canister. I'm gonna go scoop it up if I can. Oh, is there any enemies there? Uh, I... Yeah, you could say that. <laughs> Try not to piss it off, if that's what you mean. Troy, what's up, man? Is that Skyrim Stoner yep. himself? Tell Skyrim Stoner I'm trying to pick up a black box out of the middle of this uh, battlefield that the Empire obviously lost. Short on money, so I can't do. Don't worry about it, man. No, yeah, yeah, no, no, no. I, hey, but still, you know, I mean, I, 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 we're just saying. Oh, god dang it! If you can share that stuff, you know, that's all we. Hell yeah! Thank you, man. I appreciate that. Are you here? I am getting okay, ready to drop out. Fucking still when you get here. Holy fuck. What the hell did I drop into? Try a... Uh... Oh, they put me right next to you. Yeah, I don't see them anymore. I think they're gone. Well, so we can go find another non-human source. What's this Dude. ship right here? Uh, it's, I think that's an Imperial ship or an Alliance ship. Yeah, that's the fucking cutter. That's the one I want. Yeah. Oh, there you go. There's that's one a right there. sexy bitch. Let's steal it. Yeah, go Kick. right ahead. There's no life sign, so go ahead and pick it up. I'm sure it's... Yeah, uh... Picking up all this shit here. Whenever we get to the next one, you can have all the shit, damn it. <laughs> no, I'm good. I'm... Oh, Thargoid Wake. I'm gonna fucking scan that. That's wherever ship, by the way. <laughs> oh yeah, yeah, that's me. I see Thargoid Wake out here. I want to make sure I can scan. So, is there an alien ship nearby? Uh, not anymore. It left. And these good-looking ships are just sitting here floating. Ah, oh, it sucks. Might have to downsize your business even more. Oh, man, that sucks. You know, joined Grover last night, right when he logged off. <laughs> Troy joined you right when you logged off last night. Oh, out of here? Oh <laughs> shit! Yeah, if I'd have known that. Scan that Thargoid data weight. That I didn't put a fucking wake scanner on this. I put the Xeno scanner on it, and I didn't even think uh, about. You're over there trying to pick up my fucking reactive armor over there, you asshole. I just now clicked on it. I didn't know what it was. I didn't. I'm not grabbing it. It's my shit right there. No, I'm just fucking. Yeah, I'm I already went away from it. Come get it. <laughs> <laughs> Jeez. <laughs> Testing motherfucker. No, no, no. But I'm saying we can find another. I think we can find another one of these things. Just if you go into Super Cruise. Because I'm going to see if I can find you after you've uh, dropped out. And there's probably another one of these battlefields like this. You know what I'm saying? Where we can find some more of all this stuff. Oh, mass lock. That's what's going on. I was like, what the fuck? Yeah, I got a lot of merchandise for real estate sales. For COVID, they don't, they don't have any. Uh, what's that? He said he has a lot of merchandise from real estate sales, and with COVID, 
They don't have any. It's going to be real laggy coming into one of these things. Yeah, I'm noticing that. This whole fucking system's been laggy. Yeah. Non-human signal source threat level 5. Tag, tag it. Go find it. You've got your uh, Xeno scanner set up, right? I think so, but I can't fucking... I mean... It's, you, you set it to 2 like everything else. Yeah, but is it under A or B? Should it be? It'll be under exploration. It should. It could be under either one. As long as you're on exploration, it'll uh, it'll put these. It'll put all your scanners and shit out if you're under exploration. I just never know if I have to hit buttons to use the damn things. I know, like the detail you scanner, I do. do. You have to hit two to use them. Two. Just like you're using your D. Uh, I'm sorry, not two. You have to use uh, your left trigger. And it goes into like those zoom lens. No, 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 no. That's not what I'm talking about. Whenever. Uh, I'm trying to understand your, this. Your zoom lens is in uh, fire group one. It's in fire group one. You see what I'm saying? Oh shit, I'm looking at that and I went right past the fucking signal source. Did one online. Oh, so you do like real estate auctions? Did you, uh, did you come out of hyperdrive, hyperspace? I'm working on it. I went past it because I was in my fucking menu trying to figure out my okay. shits and giggles. But no, fam, we just, we're just asking everybody to share our Patreon and stuff, even if you can't you know do anything it's fine the what you can do is just share it and that's that's uh that's more than enough oh okay so you have a shop that i do some uh do some some stuff i get from wholesalers but i like to have a variety of stuff to sell shit your shop is a type that i fucking love going to because i love going to the shops and buying stuff All right, I'm out of hyperdrive or super cruise. That was a weird fucking noise. What the fuck? Oh shit! What the fuck's going on? Oh, there's a big squid thing above me. Very still. Be very still. Select him, target him, and then scan him. I just scanned him. That's like, that ship has a fucking eyeball. <laughs> These little squid things came out. Yeah. That is yeah. fucking awesome. That's the first time I've seen one of these sons of bitches. Don't get too close. Oh, uh, he was right above me. <laughs> yeah. You let him get close, but don't you get close. Let him walk or let him fly around, do his bullshit, and then he'll zoom out. Oh. Oh, he these ships. Scan his weight. That beluga got Good. fucked up. That is a noisy son of a bitch. <coughs> yeah. He's leaving. 
I don't know. He's scanning. Uh, he's here. Are you here yet? Just watching. Now I'm coming. <laughs> Raiden, what the fuck is that? That is the aliens in the game. That's, well, that's one of the aliens. I I'll, think there's more than one kind. That's the Thargoids. That's the Thargoids? Yeah. I don't know. We'll have to ask uh, Skyrim Stoner. He might know, but I, I feel like there's more than one kind of aliens in this game. Like, we went saw the Guardians, and the Guardians aren't Thargoids. I think they're ancient. And they may not be around. Uh, he just left. Okay. Well, they might not be around anymore, but I, there's other kinds of aliens, but this is the Thargoids. All right, so I have four things to pick up here. Yeah, you'll pick up a black box. When we fly back to that station, you can go to the search and rescue uh, contact, and you can give up that black box. I oh, think. no shit. Yeah. Oh, I've been doing this in the rover so good. I haven't done this in a damn... Oh, something's shooting at me. Oh, no, that might have been you popping in. A, a fucking just, streak went past my screen. I was like, fuck. I just popped in. I just popped in. <laughs> hey, <laughs> how you doing? <laughs> yeah. Is he gone? Yeah, he's gone. It showed, uh, like, the green cloud, like, open up, and he went through it, and it said signal lost. It'll say frame shift drive anomaly or something like that. It said something. I didn't. I looked over at my screen. Well, that's another thing, fam. Just just subscribe to our YouTube channels too. And share that. Share, 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 share. That's, I guess that's all I'm trying to say. Get the word out. Right. I mean. Night of the long knives has happened and we gotta, we gotta stick together. See, <laughs> <laughs> so, yeah, did you, but did you find a black box? There's I'm getting. I'm getting ready to pick it up right now. There's some uh, reactive armor out there too. I'm gonna go get it first. <laughs> go kidding. ahead. <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. No, no, no. Get it. Get it. Get it all picked up because there's all kind. Of, there's some reactive armor right there. Yeah, I only see four things on my screen. Well, that's what you got. You got two of them already. And you got those reactive armor and the black boxes out there. And then after we do that, uh, I suggest we fly to that other uh, place. Let's see. There's another. I was like, what the hell is that? That's your ship. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. There's another, there's another big space station out here. Donner's Oak, that's where we came from, and it doesn't have uh, much in the way of spaceships, so a uh, shipyard. Yeah, I, I shared the, uh, oh, I'm in the wasteland group Renee has. Yeah. It's, uh, Raiden would say make sure we share the wasteland group. Yeah, I was, yeah, I, I'm, I'm, I'd like for all our friends to know, like, uh, VP and uh, or share it to oh I see I, I didn't I'm trying to read fast <laughs> it's, uh, yeah I don't want to take my drama to other people's shit but I'd like for my friends like Renee because I can't communicate with anybody I can't communicate with anybody I'm depending on you guys so I'd like for Renee and virtual Papa and taco and all those people to know what's happened and you know and if 
just so that they know, you know, that I'm not ignoring anybody. I'm just... Well, I'm that Grover guy. He's being an asshole. Right, exactly. <laughs> I don't want people thinking that, you know. And, but I don't want to go to, I don't want, I don't want to be dragging my fucking, oh, it's the Oracle. It's 5,000 light seconds away, but I think it might be worth it. To have a good name like that, it better be good. <laughs> right. It probably ain't got a shipyard. But I, I would just like for Renee to know and for, for Virtual Papa to know and Taco and, you know, um, I mean, I know that if something like that happened to them, I would want to know immediately. You know, because it's just the way it is. I just would. So you can't really scan these ships that are blowing up, can you? No. I am headed to the Oracle. Yeah, I've done a lot more collecting in the rover than I have the ship. <laughs> so. Yeah, but, you know, at the same time, like, when you fly around a system like this, you'll find encoded stuff. You, you, you will go around collecting stuff like that, and it is helpful. And it's one of those things that that we should just spend time doing, you know. Right. It's like, you know, well, hell, there's an unidentified signal source. Let me see on my way convoy dispersal pattern, so that's not what I'm... That's obviously not what I'm after, but... But, you know, you can find the non-human thing again, stop in there, let the Thargoids do their thing, and then run around and pick shit up. So where are we at on the map here? How far out are we? Probably not that far, are we? From Earth, you mean? From, no. Far? Yeah, from our normal area. I don't know, exactly. Beyond, oh, we're pretty far. I mean, we're, it seems like it anyway. Yeah, see, degraded yeah, well. emissions. That's the kind of thing you want to look at, too. Like, I'm about to stop at this place. Degraded emissions. I think that means it's a shipwreck. And there's uh. shit to pick up. And sometimes, uh, I have never found it, but from what I understand, sometimes you'll go to these things and you'll pick up like a, there'll be an escape pod with a person in it. And that's worth something to the search and rescue people. Bear in peace. Shit, and I gotta highlight the Oracle again. Son of a bitch. That's all right. It should be right there where you, um, on your navigation screen. It shouldn't be too hard to find, is what I'm saying. Ah, oh, god dang it. I gotta stop because everything keeps fucking moving. <laughs> Damn it. Yeah. I had to do the fucking loop of shame around this fucking wreck here.
canister of bio waste. Oh, fucking fantastic. I stopped the pickup shit. <laughs> That's even better. <laughs> I got you. You better shit. believe I'm going to pick it up. I'm honking my horn at you. Remember the fucking, uh, dumbass, what's it called? Alien, no, Pr uh, Prometheus? Yeah. Remember that movie? Okay. Yeah. Remember when they found the, the, the urns and he was sticking his fingers in the slimy uh, shit? Yeah. Going, it could be a can of bio waste. You don't know. You don't know what alien shit looks like. But yeah, I, I think it's one of those things to stop a non-human signal source. Right there, do you see it? Uh-uh. It might be behind you. You know what? I'm gonna go to the I'm gonna go to the Oracle first. Cause I'm not gonna have much more time. I think uh Madison might be ready to play Fallout 76 pretty soon. But this is the, the system to run around looking for unidentified signal sources. And, and I think it'll get us a lot of maybe. I don't know. I... I mean, I've got some alien, I picked up, I think you probably did too, alien scientific evidence or something. Oh, hell, I don't even know what I picked up. Well, you see, you should pay, you should pay attention to what you put in your fucking hole. <laughs> I was just picking the shit off. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I know. That's how people eat, too. I was just eating it. Dude. Yeah, I don't pay attention. And you wonder why you're fat. Yeah. I know why I'm fat. Why I'm fat. I know why I'm fat. Get off my ass. That's why I'm fat. <laughs> no, I'm fat because I just pick stuff up and eat it. No, I got my mountain bike though. I told you that, right? No. Yeah, yeah, I've got a mount. I got my mountain bike working. Oh, you t yeah, you told me you got one, that's right? Because, uh, you know, Nick Rush has one. He has like a kid mountain bike, you know. Shit, so, the bike I take on my rods and shit. It's from Walmart. It's, that's what I've got. Yeah. And I tell you, you know, what, my friend Chad. Who wrote the who hundred shit himself. and shit himself? <laughs> uh, see, I told Amanda that I said, you know, people in my stream less still laugh about him shitting. And she's going, I was just joking though. I'm like, yeah, well, they Not didn't take it that way. <laughs> and you know what? I'm pretty sure that that's true. I see. I if I'm going to ride for competitions, I'm going to spend money on a bike. Uh, but if I'm well, just going to go. He's got a fucking perfect race bike, you know. Right. That's that's what it's for. Long distance. The Hundy is a hundred mile bike ride. Yeah. Fifty miles uphill, fifty miles oh, down. Oh, my bike has and, been in storage for six years. My bike, it it has just suffered or just gotten a fresh rebuild because I destroyed it on my last bike ride. Yeah, I remember. I saw it. <laughs> Well, Chad's, Chad's broken his fucking collarbone before. Yeah, you can get fucked up on a bike. I mean. Oh, yeah. He's He's got so many. As soon as I visit his house one time, I'm going to take pictures just to send to you. Of all of his. Uh... Oh, oh, yeah. Before you go in there. Too late. Some of these <laughs> oh. oh, I was scanning the whole way in. Yeah. But, yeah, Raiden, I, uh. My last ride, I was nine miles out on a trail, and I broke my wheel coming off the mountain. So I had to carry all my gear and my bike out of the top nine miles off the trail. <laughs> it sucked. <laughs> 
It sucked when it didn't because honestly, that's like the most composed I've been since I've been off off hurt. <laughs> so. Yeah. I can't wait for it to warm up a little bit because that's uh landing gear deployed. That's all we got a we've got a park near here. There's Thos Lake and there's um Roman Nose State Park and stuff like that. So there's lots of good places to go. Camping, you know. Trey can be without one. That's how, right now, my bike is ready. All I have to do is pack my my backpack itself, and I'm ready to go. Uh, it's sitting down in my garage. It has everything strapped to it already. I have a fishing pole hooked to it. I have a bamboo, no real fishing pole. <laughs> it's just, I mean, it's just... Cause I got, yeah. I take food with me. I don't have to fish while I'm out there. But well, if Nick I brush wants to, we get him a, a survival handbook, you know, that's big enough to fit in his backpack. It's just a little oh, thing. Oh, nice. Got tons of shit, and he wants to go do some of that stuff. You know, it's like, yeah. I mean, I guess this is for emergencies. You know, I mean, it's like. Well, that's how I take. I take my fishing pole with me, and obviously, it's. <laughs> If I catch something, it's gonna be a pain in the ass to get the fish in because I want to grab the line and pull it in, right? Or just start walking backwards and drag it up on a bank. Well, they make they make fishing rods um, that you can fold up real. Back. I know I have you know, I have what, one of those, what, but I, I wanted the bamboo one. <laughs> you know what we ought to get is a damn pocket fisherman from uh, Ron Popeil. You told me about that before. That's a real fucking thing. Yeah, it you told me about that. I don't know. If I googled it, that. and it was yeah. That's a fucking. That's a. That's legit. And that's an actual good, useful thing for Ron Popeil. <laughs> right. Not the not the hair in a can shit that you spray on your fucking bald spot. But the, you know what I mean? Like okay, I wonder where it looks like. It's like where can I go buy one? Oh wait. Thirty-one thousand yeah. for that black box. No shit. Pocket fisherman as seen on TV. That's the one I'm talking about. Oh wow. Oh, got an achievement. Boom box. Hand him, yeah, handed him one right black there. box. And, it's, and then look, it's all. Yeah, yeah, yeah. an achievement. Yeah, awesome. I wonder if this place has a has a fucking what's it called though. Nope, no fucking thing. They don't like ships in this system. <laughs> I guess they really don't. Because we can't even get ships transferred to us. Oh, that's right. We can't. I hadn't thought about that, but we sure can. There it is, Pocket Fisherman, twenty-seven ninety-nine. Oh, hold on a second, I'm gonna Google that now. I no, I had I found it on the. Uh, I was gonna throw it on the stream. Fucking <laughs> Amazon. Oh yeah, yeah, it's on Amazon. There's, they've even got. Oh man, that those paracord bracelets but they've got them they've, it's got fucking uh it's got like all kinds of shit and it's got like some fire starter shit and a little compass fucking little compass could be a lifesaver there's the vintage one looks like something from the 80s it, it looks like a fucking really rough electric toothbrush yeah is that it well that's probably the, the original i don't see that on my screen what i'm seeing is it's like the modern one uh, the blisswell fishing gear fishing rod and real combo style stuff I mean, it doesn't say 
that, but that looks like a very good pocket fisherman to have. But see, I'm looking for, as seen on TV, pocket fisherman. I'm going to put Ron, Ronco. There you go, right there. There it Ronco. is. Ronco. As soon as you said that, I saw Ronco. 1979. So Walmart. See, I'm not getting, I'm not picking up. It's not giving me like the original. Maybe if I had just Google or fucking looked that up from images on the, my search thing. Make sure there's no porn hubs on my browser. Okay, we're good to go. Here we go. Right, Is that right. it, Grover? Ronco. Oh, well, shit. I'm not there. Hang on. Uh, here we go. I don't know. I'm, I'm, 30, I'm, like, I'm like a minute and a half behind you, apparently. <laughs> well, I can take it off the screen because I left it on there for like 30 seconds. That is, yes, that is it. Twenty dollars at Walmart. Totally They're out of stock, is. but yeah, that's now that's the modern version of that. Oh, I found the a vintage one, one, and it's like sixty-eight dollars. <laughs> yeah, the vintage one is like that tan color that, and it's oh, it seems bigger than that. <laughs> That's what she said. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, see? Yeah, 31000 for that. Thank you, Commander. Yeah, here's the... See, this is a vintage Pop, Popel's Pocket Fisherman. Ron Popeil. Okay, Popeil. Ronco. Okay. Ron Popeil. He's... Man, that dude is fucking fantastic. Love Ron Popeil. It makes shit sing exciting as fuck. It's like, I think he's the one that invented fucking infomercials. <laughs> you just take up 30 minutes. To From into the 1970s into the vintage Popeil's Pocket Fisherman. Yeah, that's exactly right. Put it up on your fucking screen so I can see that shit. You have to wait a minute and a half. <laughs> <seconds, apparently>. <laughs> <laughs> Damn it. Just put it up there for a few seconds and pull back that shit. Yeah, watch. Never know what happens on the stream. We're looking up fishing rods. <laughs> right. right. But see, that's the kind of thing, though, when you're talking about a bug out bag, that's the kind of thing you might really be. Because, like you say, it's kind of a bitch. You're going to have to pull, drag it in right. with your hands. You don't have to do that with that. Well, yeah, see, that's it, and that's Perfect where motherfucking fisherman. And I'm, I'm, I got the bamboo fishing pole because I thought it'd be kind of fun. Because where I go, there's a bridge that you can sit on. A stream is like trout fishing right under. I mean, perfect. I mean, the, right. where they put that bridge is made just to sit on the bridge and it's cast it on. It's all bad, but whatever. Huh? Yeah. What's it's that? Oklahoma, it's all bad. Oh. It's all bass fishing. Yeah, yeah, see, it's well, it's where I'm where uh, I'm going. It's all mountain stream. The water's real fucking cold, and it all you see up there is fucking trout. <laughs> so, but I get to see myself with just I just have to drop the line straight down and go with it. And I pack my own food. It's not like I'm going to expect to survive off a of fish. <laughs> right. Fuck. Well, uh, you know what. When you're a desperate man, you will. Well, this is for just a camping trip, <laughs> not a survival trip. Oh, oh, oh yeah, 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 okay, yeah. okay, okay. But <laughs> you practice. You practice for when you're desperate. Damn it. I might order myself one of those. Uh, not this one. This one's sixty-eight dollars. I'll go ahead and get. No, the no, no, no. But if you go to if you go to to Amazon, dude, like. One of the first things, it's an Amico fishing gear pocket fishing rod. I think that would go in a bug out bag real easy. And it's a telescoping rod, you know. So it's like, it's like a pretty much a full size fishing rod, but it goes down into a, about the size of the damn 
uh, real, you know? Right. Yeah, I ever get out to your house, we gotta go fucking camping, looking for the Grafton Monster camping. You ever come up here? Yeah. We're gonna go stay at the Grafton Dam, which is called Taggart okay. Lake. And there's camping there, they have log cabins there, they have yeah. uh, trails there, yeah. fishing, boat rentals. It's uh, it is literally like two uh, minutes from my house. I live uh, I live on a road they take to take the boats to the dock. Man, I gotta I gotta get I gotta get my camera all ready so we can fucking Yeah, it's I mean GoPros. and get it's GoPros nice ready so about five, get six years ago ready. they put it they actually they've been hauling sand down there so they made a man made man made beach. Yeah. So the sand's oh. hard because like I mean, it's not the same as yeah. going to the ocean, but yeah, no, it's yeah, nice yeah. because you can go and just relax and. Sure. They used to have a real like their well, lodge. Know, we have a place. We have a place called Beaver's Bend here. That's Beaver's where Bend. I'm going to stay when I come your way. You gotta come. Yeah, you gotta come. It's up in the Panhandle, so it's not like next door. I'm going to get and, and I, I'm going to get those magnetic. Uh, advertising logos they have for cars i want to slap it on the side of whatever rental i bring out there and drive right into the beaver place if if my damn car didn't look like shit so bad i would do the same thing i'd slap them right on the side oh fuck i'll be i'd be bringing a rental (laughs) my poor old cars they won't make the trip (laughs) (laughs) see i've got a 2000 mercury mountaineer i have a 1990 buick century I'm st- oh, I, I, I drove a 1979 Buick Century. I love my car, man. That's it a- had a giant back seat, if you know what I mean, and I think you do. Oh, yeah. I just left a mine several times. Oh, well, I didn't mean by myself. <laughs> well, yeah, but I haven't had mine since I was, you know. <laughs> <laughs> That's true. That's yeah. true. <laughs> nah, fuck. That car, most people are like, why the fuck do you have that car? I was like, man, I love that car. <laughs> yeah. I didn't buy that car because I had to. I bought that car because I was in love with it. Because I wanted to, yeah. I have never owned a car that I wanted to own. I've had cars that I liked. That's not what I'm saying, but I'm, I've never bought a car specifically because this is the car that I wanted. Right. Like, really, I guess, you know what I want? I guess I want an F-250. I would love to have an F-250. You know what I mean? See, that's I where that's. A truck. I just want a truck. I don't care right. if it's a Chevy, a Ford. Dodges are a little too hard on gas for me. I, but I want I something have, domestic to where I can work on it. Yeah, yeah. I have just really like. I've driven Fords, and I've liked the Fords that I've driven. So. Well, I've had know. Fords and I've had Chevys, and honestly, as little as I would have used, like, I, if I buy a truck, it's because I want. It's going to be used. As a truck, a home. The second you don't have one is the second you realize you fucking need absolutely. It. Yeah, I I went out to fuck. Like, ask me how we got Nicholas's bike home from the fucking Walmart that's an hour away. Oh yeah, I understand. Jeez. I got scratches on top of my fucking Subaru because I had a whole. I didn't have a bike rack. Right. And I had to haul two bikes home. Yeah. <laughs> so I had to just lay them down in a scratch a little fuck. I have dents up there and everything from the pedals. Yeah, yeah. And yeah. See, I, that Mercury Mountaineer, mine, I got it because uh, when I was at the at, at Animal Control, you didn't, you don't get snow days, you know, when you're at the police department. <laughs> There's no such thing. But uh, so I got that Mercury Mountaineer because it had four wheel drive. It was all wheel drive, you know. And that way I could just, I could get to work. Right. You know, and I could get to call outs and things like that when I needed to. And um, I really, I really like the vehicle. You know, I like it. I like the vehicle. And I might have chosen to buy it on purpose. You know what I mean? Other than it was just a, a, a purchase of opportunity. And, um, but I've never gotten to buy a car that I've, just wanted like like i say i would buy an f-150 or an f-250 you know uh high in the sky probably an f-250 right like a modern one 
All right, I say that shit. I'd kind of like to have a, a perfectly running uh, one from about 1994. You know, yep. <laughs> that would be all right to me. That's how I'm kicking myself in the ass. I might told you about this. There was a, uh, it was a '95 Chevy Silverado. I think it was just a 1500, and it looked like it just came off the showroom floor. I mean, it was perfect fucking shape, and it had 50,000 original miles. Yeah. He wanted 800 bucks for it. Ah. Uh. And. I'm really restricted right and now, so I actually no. I called I called my mom and I was like, "Hey, can you look at this truck and spot me 800 until yeah. you know I get my next paycheck?" I was like, "I'll I'll be able right. to pay you then." Right. And she said, "Well, send me the link." And when I went back to look for the link, it was fucking gone. Uh, that fucking quick, dude. Yeah, I guarantee it. And It'd I have been like, gone if I just saw it. Fuck. I'd have been like, "I'll sell you my children. I'll just." Here, you can have my kids until I come up with the money. <laughs> I, well, I should have contacted him. Like, right then. I should have been like... Well, he was probably <coughs> on the phone with the mother. Yeah, yeah I was just... Years. Oh, I was, I was sick to my that's, stomach that I missed that. That's, that's the unicorn. You found the unicorn. I found the unicorn. Your virginity at the same time. And then, and you, find you it know, anymore. and I'm, I'm searching for stuff, and then I'm seeing vehicles that are listed for $800. And they look like an eight hundred dollar vehicle. Yeah, you know, it's like I'm right. now. I'm like I'm not spending that. <laughs> it's like, right, right. Eight hundred dollars. I was like, oh fuck me, yeah. man. Yeah, yeah, that's pretty. That's There's Lexi. Oh, Lexi. <laughs> she said, "What up?" <laughs> what up, sluts? I know what you. <laughs> what up, sluts? You just missed, missed our slideshow. We were showing fishing poles on a stream. Right. <laughs> she said, Hi, Grover. Hello. <laughs> Here, I'll see if it. Oh, it's not up. I closed the window up. Fuck. I was going to show her the rod that you want. You'll be back soon. We'll still be here. Let's see. Yeah, we we're Googling fishing poles on the dam. <laughs> I was Googling them. I was swiping them over to the stream. Fucking miss y'all having withdrawals. <laughs> what you need to get in your place first. And get settled, and then find yourself a decent price Xbox. Now with the new ones out, you should find a good deal on Xbox. I check like GameStop. Let's see what else is here. We just were hunting aliens. It's pretty fucking cool. Yeah, yeah, that's pretty much bullshit, Lexi. I'm sorry that I haven't. Let's see, I want to bookmark this place. Delphi 5A you can land on, so I'm going to go there. Let's 
Raiden's back. Raiden. Yeah, I'm headed to Delphi 5. Because you can land on that planet. And there might be some. Sure. Run around and look. Being that this system's all fucking Xeno shit. Xeno had beavers on it. <laughs> all right, all right. Lexi says she's going through withdrawal. She misses us all. Uh, trust me, so am I. Oh fuck, that's like right next door to the station. I didn't know that. Man, this whole damn planet is dark. Even the light side's darker. <laughs> yeah. Oh, this is a rough looking planet. I don't know if I want to have a good place to land. Well, I will come do that here in a moment. I'm still looking at the uh, oh, place. I was going to see if I could uh, get on, if I could turn on the fucking camera on here. Yep. I'm not an admin on your channel, am I? No, I, I don't even know how to set that up. Yeah, see, I, I'm I'm right there in you. And that's where I wish I could. Hold on a second. Hold on a second. You're trying to land. Don't be fucking with other shit. Oh yeah, I'm landing. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> that only have a page up. Okay, here we go. Yeah, you should probably just be careful. <laughs> ah, fuck what it. What you're doing? At least I'll spawn close. <laughs> so, That's shit. true. It brought it up on that screen. Oh no! What am I doing? Okay, we're good. We're good. <laughs> oh, holy crap! <laughs> <laughs> well, if I'd have known, if I'd have known I'd have brushed my fucking hair. <laughs> I was going to try to make the windows small and go over, but I don't. It keeps taking. It keeps dropping my uh, streamlabs out every time I do that. No, don't. Just saying. Yeah, that's what I'm. That's what I was wanting to try to do, though. I was wanting to try to get it to where everyone's cameras were on. Are on there? Yeah. I don't know. I don't know how that would work. I don't know how that would work, but I was just wanting to see if I could do that. See, because I had to make Lexi an admin on, uh, the other day before she could show. Yeah, before and I, I didn't touch any of my settings because I have no fucking clue how. Right. <laughs> so. right. Lexi might know more about fucking... Uh, Discord no, and I did. We were all in it the other day and she oh. was shit. <laughs> <laughs> she was all fucked up. She was like, I don't know. This is making me mad. Uh, once we figure it out, it'll be good. No, nah, it won't be bad once. Oh, fuck. Oh, fuck. See, I am wondering what happened to that information that I scanned. Oh, And 
this fucking thing I've got is this asp is pretty set pretty well. 5A, 5A, 5A. Modified 5A. 4A power distributor. Passenger cabins, you can buy passenger cabins here. Put one of those in an asp. <laughs> well, I mean, you can. You absolutely can. It's a little you know, cramped, so. guys, but get the fuck in. Right. <laughs> They're small passenger cabins, but... Shit, I, I wonder if what they've got in the way of... They have six slot passenger cabins, too. First class passenger cabin. They have one. It's six C. Are you fucking kidding me? This little window I have to park is like really fucking small. Yeah. Codex ah. discoveries. 50,000. New Codex discoveries. Oh, because I scanned the fucking... What, what, where are you at? What's the plant that's down there? It's the one, uh, Del 5 5A. It's right next to the station. Gotcha. Tracking beavers on Yeah, see, I don't know why I couldn't land in half these places, because it looks like you should be able to. Yeah. You might be able to, you just have to turn your nose up and do some other shit. Well, it let me. I, I landed finally, but it's like I got really close to the ground, and I was just yeah. moving real slow and watching it. <laughs> just waiting for it to turn blue. I think it's blue. I hope it's blue. It really disappoints me whenever I think something of a certain color for the longest time. I know, and everybody tells me it's something else. It's <laughs> yeah, like, oh. it's like, oh, man. I really, I really enjoyed that color blue. <laughs> right. That was fucking pink, or whatever the fuck color it is. It's usually green. If I think it's blue, then it's usually green. I mean, with me, it's usually purple. Yeah. It's, uh... it's usually like a, I'm guessing it's like a teal. Yeah, see, my my color palette does not cover all the different shades of certain colors. Well, yeah, I've been an artist for so long. Yeah, it is, it's well, it's like uh, everything kind of blends in. Right. And that's I think the best way I can describe my color blindness is like it's more like color confusion. Yes, yeah. probably like that. Yeah. I'm down here for less than five minutes. I found a rock to shoot already. Good. I think I'm gonna go back into the damn. Cargo scoop deployed. Ring because I think I just picked up what I needed to make my frame shift drive. But you know what? No, I'm not either. 
Well, don't forget about it. No, no, I won't. I mean, it's just, I'm not leaving here. I'm not trying to go back to, uh, back to anywhere. I'm yeah, I'd like to find a station near here that we can, that we can make yeah, a home base for now. Kind of tip forward operating base for us there. Because I'd like to start just like, keep moving. Yeah, you know, I'd like to start heading towards Sagittarius A, just finding new home bases and do yes. missions when we get there and move on. Which is another reason why I need to sell another ship. That way I'm not constantly shipping a bunch of ships everywhere. Well, if you see one you want to sell, I mean, I don't know. Do you have a Type 7 still? No, I sold it and I sold my Pirate Lance. I'm keeping my Anaconda and I'm keeping my Type 9. And I have a Diamond. See, I was about to tell you that you might, whenever we decide to, to get into mining, that Type 7 is going to be worth having. Well, yeah, I traded my Type 7 in on my Type 9. I might do that. I might take my Type 7 and turn it into a mining vessel. Right. Oh, it would be and perfect start. for it. Practicing the mining over there in, uh, in Atropos. Because it's got, Atropos has some places to, to mine. Oh, well, found and another rock already. Fucking diamonds, but. Well, that one dude was making a ton of money. I might get, what's that little one? The, the hauler or whatever? That that one dude was using yes. in that video? Yeah, yeah, there's a hauler. Yeah, he, and he, that's what he was doing all of his shit with. Yeah. Yeah, this planet might be a pretty good planet to, for resources. Because I've already found two sources. Yeah. I'm trying to come in and park next to you, and I was going to go the opposite direction, you know? Oh, there you are. Did my ship take off? Oh, it might have. That might be you. Oh, yeah, I see it. Okay. Hey, yeah, I see that streak up there. Yeah, because I was using it as my point, to, so I knew where, which way I was going. <laughs> right, yeah. <laughs> I'm not it's just not going like in circles. This works all that well. <laughs> Yeah, I wish you could have seen my face whenever my ship got blown up when I, as soon as I got out of it. <laughs> oh. It's like, what? It was kind of cool, though, because you your ship parts didn't disappear. There it is laying there. It looked it looked like that Anaconda shipwreck that, was, that we went to. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> We're gonna watch a river come out. 
could you uh, tell me when you're there and I'll... I'm right here. Did you see? I was trying to buzz you. I was going to shoot some brown <laughs> but, I, but my guns are gimbled, so they were fucking locked on on <laughs> That would be well, good. I do that. John Gray, what's <laughs> up, man? <laughs> Hey, look at that. Another four point landing. Here I can. Oh, your ship actually lifts up a little bit whenever you open your, your bay doors or whatever. Oh, yeah? Yeah, that's kind of cool. I okay, this stretches his legs a little bit. Uh, well, I'm trying to watch your screen since I'm like two, <laughs> two hours behind. I want to see dude. myself come out of my ship. Yeah, I know. I don't, I don't even see it. I, the detail of it though, usually it's just kind of loads. Oh, you're there. You know, it's like. Yeah, yeah. I guess I'll send my ship away now. Oh, shit. Rock. Oh, no. Get back at her. Whoo, damn. I about really fucked up. I don't even know what direction. Okay, I'm going this way. <laughs> I rolled so many times, I didn't know which way I was pointing. <laughs> right. I'm going to go the other way from you and just see what we see. What we see. I was hoping to see some alien shit since we're in the system of all that stuff that's here. Uh, I don't know. I, I never did look at the. I should have opened up the damn. Oh, is that a valley? I should have opened up the. Uh, um, the system screen. I wonder if you can do that here. Yeah, you can. Surface map. I never even looked at that. Surface map. Let's see what that does. I didn't even know there was a surface map. Yeah. No, there doesn't seem to be anything. It's not tracking anything on me. But Your controller batteries are dying. These things vibrating so much kill my fucking batteries constantly. See, mine, I don't know, man. The, the thing that I've got, the Nyko, NYKO, rechargeable batteries and stuff, they, they last forever. See, mine are... Power a mine are the Xbox ones, yeah, and they're the, the, the orange power packs. And I recharge them, I have fucking five of them. Oh, are you fucking kidding me? What's wrong? Server broadcast greetings, commanders. Our servers will be coming down in 30 minutes. Oh, well, I guess I better head back to the ship. No, I get. Yeah, I'm gonna land my ship, I guess. I'm gonna try to get to the other side of the valley, and then I'll go back to that station. Yeah. At least you noticed it this time. Last time we didn't even notice it. We just got kicked out. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> See you, fuckers. Like, <laughs> yeah, I thought the last. I looked up and said you got two minutes. I'm like, oh shit. <laughs> Two oh, minutes for what? That. <laughs> I hate that about these games, though, man. Is they do that crap. You know what, though? I can appreciate it with this game because it's there's so much that they keep up on. It's, it's true. Phenomenal. Yeah. That's one thing I can show off on my stream constantly is detail. That's <laughs> right. Because it's in everything. Yeah. Right, it is. These rovers that you can only see when. When you're looking at someone else's rover, it has a ton of fucking detail on it. Yeah, yeah, they really do.
Oh, this might be a good landing zone. Oh, well, what a good place for me to roll. Free call ship. Taking longer than usual. There it is. I was gonna say it should. We should be hearing it soon. You're leaving and mine's landing. Yeah. <laughs> well, though, you might be right. There might be alien shit on one of these planets in here. I don't know. tomorrow instead of doing rep I actually might fuck around on these planets I, I'm glad you brought me here that's kind of yeah. cool it's a neat place like you you ought to fly around looking at all these uh, things you know the, all yeah. the, the stuff to, to get Crushing beavers online. What a motherfucker. When does that motherfucker sleep? <laughs> I always forget to retract my landing gear. Well, I'm going so damn slow. Yeah, I need to go, man. Everything's just slow. What the fuck? Oh. Frame shift drive charging. Pony Farm, Legion of the Wolf, Exerted Heart. Listening post. They popped in here and said, you have no chance now. I'm at a fucking space station. I dare you to start shooting at me. <laughs> Is fuck it. I I favorited it. I'm looking at it that way. Yeah. See, I I shared the but but I put that in there and it and when I shared it to the squadron, it popped up on your deal, didn't it? So yeah, Delphi's favorited, but the. Yeah. Uh, What is it, the Oracle? 
Is that where we're at? Or we're at a different one? Oracle. Oracle is where we are. It's not in my fucking... It's there. No, it's not in that shit. Yeah, I, just, I favorited it. The Delphi? I no, I favored the Oracle. station that we were in, yeah. Um, well, bookmarks, fuck. under bookmarks, right? I didn't see it. Oh, well. Well, it's, it's the Oracle, and it's it's here. It's right above us uh, from that planet, of course. By the time I find it, it won't be. Because <laughs> I'm, I'm still moving. <laughs> well, yeah, that's... Slow down, is what I'm trying to say. There it is. <laughs> 200 light seconds. See, that planet right next to the Oracle has those rings. We might be able to do some mining right there. Yeah, I get, yeah, yeah. But you can't store a fucking ship here, so it's like... Yeah, yeah, get your fucking ship here is the only thing. You'd have to go get it and bring it back, and I'm, I'm not sure I'm prepared for that, because there's probably places closer to Atropos or whatever where it is that we can actually fucking get the stuff easier. That's some big-ass rings, though. It might be... I wonder if we can put any mining shit on the ass. <laughs> you can, you can. Uh, you just, you know, the the bigger ships are better because you right. put better stuff. You can carry more shit. Right. Your Type 9 would probably be the ultimate fucking mining vessel. Yeah, to get it here, though, holy fuck. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Well, See, if we go one system over, if we go one system over, we might find a station and just make one jump to get here. We might, yeah, we might. So, just the next time one of us is on, since this fucker's closing down on us. Yeah, under transactions, I have 1,500 wing, uh, wing trade and then 50,000 credit codex discoveries and then the zero credit fine <laughs> and then it says buy yeah. nobody. And so, I, what the fuck is that uh, fine? I don't know. I don't know. Well, this remains unpaid. It's zero. What the fuck? <laughs> I don't know. <coughs> I think with the with the reset of the week that stuff goes away, but I don't Maybe. Know. I don't know for sure. Landing gear deployed. <laughs> all right that'll do it for my stream they are kicking us off of this game for tonight <laughs> so but thanks for all the love and before i go i am going to drop a few links be sure to check them out oh i gotta change the chat
Been doing good all day and then I fucked up. There we go. One more. <laughs> There's always one more. One more. All right. Yes, be sure to check out Trek and Beaver and Grover's Mill on Patreon and on YouTube. And thanks again for all the love. We all appreciate it. And I will catch you all later. Bye-bye. Later, Beaver Stream.